Your bit rate's fucked, by the way, in here. Like, you look so blurry. I, I think it's, it's yeah, it looks kind of blurry. Me, so. It's fine. It's probably not fine. Oops. Ah, and you have like 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 We just all three said a separate sentence at the same time. <laughs> Watch the, yeah. the happiness drain well, from their eyes. You keep them linked, so when you beat one of them, they both feel it. When you grab it and fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> Seen died of heartbreak, right? Oh, I can't betray all those kids anymore. <laughs> Was he like a Bond villain? Yeah, yeah I can see him wearing a thong underneath his clothes. <laughs> well, I mean, they're not giving him out for free. It's not a I know they're not giving him out for free. That's not true. Show. That's not true. Shh, 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 shh. Me and Poop are talking now. It's, you, know, you ever I mean, shoot a, a prisoner in the face just to teach the other ones a lesson? Funnily yeah. enough, a lot of the criminals are do do wear glasses. Because how studious we are. <laughs> we. <laughs> I did. Uh, oh. Hey, what's up, guys? This is episode 70 of the Forehead Fables podcast. No, we were supposed isn't. to have, isn't it? Is it? Yeah, I think I so. Have no idea. Yeah, we we're supposed to have a uh, uh, donut operator on, and then it turned out that uh, uh, my kids got sick last week, and I didn't really have the time to like actually prepare something. So uh, I got rid of them, and then I, most convenient message I've ever gotten on Twitter. I got a DM. <laughs> I never check like the. If you're not friends with someone request. and you get a DM, it's like a yeah message request. I get message requests from this guy. He's like, dude, I, I like work in like a prison as a guard or something like that. If you want like a guest for the podcast, I'd be happy to come on. I'm like, hey, can you do tomorrow at one? And he's like, sure. And then uh, and I was like, I should talk to this guy on Discord first to make sure he's not a like a psycho or something. And I, I talked to him. This is him. Ju Julian, right? Julius, yes. Julius, sorry. Mm -hmm. Julius. And he fucking speaks to me, and I'm like, you're not... I was thinking like a prison guard from Rikers, you know, like a hard-boiled <laughs> badass. And he's like, oh, I'm like Swedish. Oh, yeah, exactly what I sound like. Yeah. yeah. And I'm like, oh, they, they're they known for having the most lax, pussy-ass prisons. We got this... <laughs> <in."> <laughs> like, what? what's like... They're you like were a guard, right? Things. Like, what were you... What was your job just, in the... Like in the prison world, the easiest way to put it is just a prison guard. Like, there's no other way to that's the title of it, if that makes sense. Okay, it's just a straight up prison guard. You carry because let me tell you something, yeah. yeah. Carry around a big billy club at times, sometimes. <laughs> you don't well, look like a guy that would be, no offense, able to contain like a badass, fucking right. maximum security. Yeah, murderer. No, no, I get that, <laughs> I get that, but you know, I have the experience. You, know, you ever I mean, shoot a, a prisoner in the face just to teach the other ones a lesson? That like to send a message? Me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, that hasn't happened yet. Thankfully. All right. Can we get like an? If anybody's watching this, that's like an actual <laughs> prison guard for like an actual. Prison. Yeah, like a prisoner, a prison guard that like shoots prisoners. <laughs> yeah. 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 People. people that like are willing to talk about their crimes against humanity. Like if you're in the <laughs> audience, come any on dirty up. prison guards. <laughs> you know, yeah. dirty prison guards. I had a no colleague. like. What's the uh, uh, what's the average like uh, vibe of a Swedish prison? Because they look like resorts to me. Was just about to say something about a colleague that was maybe a dirty. Prison. Yeah, oh, oh, no, yeah. yeah. Like, narc, no. narc on your colleagues. Uh, I had a colleague who was down in like Somalia. Um, oh. as, as some kind of like. <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah. This yeah is it's getting Somalian prison. I'm out. Somalia. Somalia. This is... <laughs> okay. Okay. So. Oh. Um, he told me all about this when he came back. Obviously, he was there as some sort of diplomat to see if they follow like actual guidelines. And you know, he was down there for about six months, I think, uh, just you know, spying and see how they do a prison compared to us. And what the fuck? did he go in as an was inmate? He scouting for talent, to, like yeah. recruiting guards. Not, like, what? <clears throat> I mean, I guess kind of, kind of. They come back and go, they don't even give them TVs or whatever. Like, he came back with something even worse. So apparently they're giving shovels and the gate is completely open. So they're free to leave. However, there is a guy with an AK right next to the, um, the actual gate of the entire prison. Uh, so if you do leave, uh, you essentially get shot. And the other people... <laughs> Like mod game too. Yeah, it's so horrible. I would it's just horrible. fucking block the bullets with the shovel. They gave oh, you a pretty yeah. really good. I'd just get enough of them to make some sort of armor. <laughs> I'd sharpen the shovel. Or I, would, I would take a tunnel. Scoop the shovel and make it into like a highlight scoop. So when they shoot mm -hmm. it, they would hit it and go, yeah, right there. Yeah. Wing, I'll throw it. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. There's That's so, like, weird that they would send someone to Somalia. Yeah. I figured like Somalia, maybe like El Salvador might be the. I mean, he's been working for like, in the world. He's been working in prisons almost his entire life. So, you know, he has the experience. So that's why they sent him and nobody else kind of, kind of thing. Life sentence of work. <laughs> yeah, exactly. exactly. Like, yeah. I still don't understand what he was there. For. Like, what was he, he doing? Was he was there to spy on Somalians. <laughs> Honestly, I wish I knew. I wish <laughs> I knew why. Like, like, oh my what God, he bring dude. Back? Shovels. You know? Brought back one of the shovels or something. Yeah, he brought back some interesting stories, at least, you know? Well, what's that guy, Anders, mm-hmm. Anders Breivik? You know that guy? Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's a he's a dude that shot up all those people in, in mm-hmm. Sweden. And there's huge like international uh-huh. outrage when pictures were leaked of his prison cell and he it looks like an IKEA showroom. Like he's got this beautiful room with like fresh linens, a fucking TV and, he and everything. Got a PlayStation. Yeah, he's you know, like, yeah, he's got like game and consoles he, and shit. And apparently, he bitched about the games because it was oh, just like no Ratchet skate three. And Clank. <laughs> yeah. skate three. What the fuck? They t- yeah, they took away yeah. the servers. They turned off the God. online function. That sucks. Yeah. Oh. Uh, and funnily uh, enough, he's Norwegian, so he's from the same oh, country as Muslim. Fuck. No, he but it's okay. You know, we're kind of similar. We're kind of similar. Very similar. Yeah. Like Norway is like the capital of Sweden, I think. Like the capital. The capital yeah. country of Sweden, yeah. <laughs> like um, the capital city of Sweden or something? The I, used to, I used to piss yeah. off uh, Muscle Bus saying that because he fucking hates Oh, yeah, being, Stockholm? Yeah, we, uh, yeah, he hates yeah. getting confused with, with Swedish people. Can I do a uh, can I do a little aside thing really quick? What? Okay, so for, hold on. Let me make myself bigger. I can do that. So there's been some, like, stank. You're very on the, fucked, by the way, in your... Like you look so blurry. I, don't, I think it's, it's yeah, it looks kind of blurry lights stuff. It's fine. It's, it's fine. probably it's not okay. fine. There's okay. been some like complaints out there because of this like new software we're using. Streamlabs and they or yeah or, or Streamyard and they've been there's been some complaints like oh I like the old format of the show better than the new format but let me tell you something we're doing oh, like we're boy. at a new series a new era of the show. The we're decline. frankly. Part yeah, two. it's the, the, the huge <laughs> decline of the show. No, we, we realized we had so many guests where, like, we invited them on and they're just too retarded to fucking record their own shit with their own audio the yeah, way it should yeah. be. And so, like, if you want to have more guests like Told in Stone or maybe everybody's favorite Julius here, mm-hmm. they, they, like, these highly sought after guests that might be a little bit more uh, technologically inept. We're gonna have to use StreamYard because it's like no brainer. You can have anybody on here. Somebody could connect with their the phone and still be yeah. a good guest, you yeah. know. And then there's no fuck up possible. Like if you can hear them on the show, that's not true. It's not there's true because there's some issue. audio fuck there's ups. But issue. yeah, there yes. is there's never like a golden gun. There's never a fucking end all be all solution to this stuff. Except Whoa. for one thing, I was trying to. Yeah, but convince... We don't have to deal with the audio sync, so. That's I true. Like we don't. It's, e- it's, yeah, it's easier on us. It's yeah, easier. On, awesome. Like Julius don't have to do shit. I didn't make no, him download just, OBS and do no, all the was, audio track stuff. I was confused. I was like, what yeah. do I need? Like software wise? The beer? And you were like, here's a link. Yeah. Here's just show link. up. Exactly. Uh, just show and up. so it changes the aesthetic. I'll admit it things are like a little bit different, thing. but we can have weirder guests. We can have wackier guests. We can have people on that like, yo, I just realized because of the distortion, look how tiny my little ceiling fan looks. <laughs> You're in like 140p oh, on my that's screen. A fa- that's a fan? Yeah, it's a little oh. ceiling fan. Oh, yeah. I see it, yeah. yeah. Oh, It's so Stop. tiny. Turn that light off. That light is, I'm 99% sure that's why your bit rate's so bad. No, no, <laughs> no, no, it's light. fine. No, okay. It's part of the show. Uh, it's part yeah. of the show. Also, it's fine. I feel like this wasn't intentional, but I do think it's funny that the first time we're just kind of having a viewer on as a guest mm-hmm. is immediately following the gamer hole episode where they just did that for the first time. Oh, really? That they just released a couple of days ago. I don't, I don't pay any attention to the gamer well, hole, so I wouldn't do that's uh, honest to gosh. Uh, yeah, and we know Brian, you know. you're the one that sets up all the guests and everything. Yeah, exactly. so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. but me, uh, so, the yeah. guy that sets up the guests and also <laughs> avid fan of the gamer hole, <laughs> love all those guys. Um, I stole this idea from them. Definitely. Did you? Oh, had okay. nothing to do with us panicking about having to do two episodes in one week and going like, <laughs> shit. Like, what are we? Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, this is, can... and Poob's going through his Brian arc where he's going to crinkle bags in the mic. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, oh, after man. you're finished with that, can you get like a pin and just like click, 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 
click, click, well, yeah, click, click yeah. for, the, for the rest of the episode. <laughs> you're a twitchy guy, Brian. You're a way too twitchy yeah, of a you're guy. You're fucking I'm freaky. Cracked, mate. I'm yeah. cracked. Yeah. Cracked, mate. Uh, Anyways, back to this whole prison thing. Mm-hmm. So, like, uh, what's the, what is, like, the average accommodations for, like, did you work, like, super max, or were you, like, a regular prison guard? Like, uh, like what, what's yeah. the, the type of, of convicts that you're dealing with? Uh, personally, uh, Sexual I worked in abusers. a, uh, <laughs> that was actually one of the few I uh, didn't work with. Oh, nice. Um, but, you know, it was a high security prison, so we had, you know, all kinds of, criminals you can imagine uh, but personally i will worked in the we have like separated blocks for what they've done or what kind of clients they are uh, so i worked in the violence in close relationships part for the most of my time so that means you know your average wife beaters to you know child murders that kind of thing i feel like sam's gonna become one of those could you probably profile him do you think he's at risk yeah, do I like match the? He, the he's, you know, it's yeah, something about those eyes. He seems like a child like, murderer. It's something about those eyes, you know. Is it yeah. like? Was there like a common feature, like a trait that each of these people had? Uh psychopaths. Or like the, funny glasses. Yeah, yeah. Like actually, glasses. funnily enough, yeah. a lot of the criminals are do do wear glasses, so you know. Right. Really yeah, absolutely. Because how studious we are. <laughs> we. Yeah. Um, Oh, Lots of mind. reading about crime scene procedure and how to evade mm. and stuff like that. Mm. Yeah. <clears throat> but some of us it's wear so contacts good. when they could be wearing glasses and they're trying to... It's almost like it's Blend a disguise. In. Yeah, <laughs> like they're trying to get out of the archetype. That's even scarier than glasses. <laughs> yeah, even more Man, frightening. LASIK. Don't get me started on those fucking psychos. <laughs> like, goddamn that, LASIK. Lizard there's people. nothing worse than someone that gets LASIK eye surgery. That's like... <laughs> The Michael Jackson equivalent for murderers. <laughs> yeah. uh, murderers? I thought it was fucking abusers. <laughs> abusers uh, or well, whatever. Are these murderers? Child yeah, murderers, murderers are just like the, violent people. Murderers. Now, is that oh. a child that murdered? Or is that, you know, the yeah. less fun option? So it's like you mean a, like a, a kindergarten kind of block in the prison? Like a, yeah. Oh, I wouldn't be too scared to work that. I could probably even... <laughs> yeah. Even oh, I could true. be a guard there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> They fucking, I don't know, <laughs> hit him with the fucking stick and walk around and whistle <laughs> yeah. and stuff. That doesn't sound too bad. I, you know, what I realize is there's no like, there's no equivalent. Like for you, all this stuff's normal. Mm-hmm. Like, Absolutely. yeah, because I'm trying to think. Like you, see, you guys have seen Oz, right? Have you seen that show, HBO show about prison life in the U.S.? I'm poor. I don't have HBO. Oh, you don't. fucking uh, crazy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, they, yeah. Uh, there's this old show Oz and it was like that that was my it came out when I was like a young kid and I used to watch it, it had JK Simmons in it and he's just like uh, constantly getting his dick sucked by other dudes in prison and stuff. And this is so on so HBO. Cool. Yeah, okay. it's on HBO. And uh and I'm sitting there like watching the show. I'm like, dude, this is what prison's like. And then for you, if I went to your prison that you worked at, I'd be like, dude, they're serving these guys like tiramisu and stuff with uh with dinner, like do you even know that, or is that just an assumption? Yeah, like, what is just an assumption. Is. That's why I'm saying, like, yeah, about. yeah, like how, <laughs> like, what, what level of food do they have and stuff? Like, is this? Do you feel like you treat prisoners nicer than they should be treated, considering their crimes? Um, like mm. food wise, we're talking lunchables quality it's you know nothing oh special. so they had, like fun stuff that they could like build it's like the, the frozen low tier food i guess is the best way you can say it what okay. about the bedrooms like brian's bedroom or yeah. Yeah. to brian's bedroom absolutely. my regular my yeah. actual yeah. one my actual yeah, one. yeah. yeah. yeah he's in his yeah. uh mountain he's home his, right his now guest house yeah yeah, yeah this is my yeah. temporary <laughs> This is where, like, his mother in law suite. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what about, um, what about you ever walk down the thing with the baton and hit all the bars? Yeah. You ever do that and you go, their knuckles. Yeah. <laughs> you start banging on them. Um, sadly, I'm very sad to say there are no bars in that kind of way. Oh, they just got doors that are locked. It's just like regular doors. Like, 
they have like doors with a small little hatch that you open up essentially uh before oh, you, you open up the hatch in there and rat, rattle yeah, around yeah you can you can it's like, it's like a little tiny box where you can do whatever you want with kind of thing oh cool they ever stick their hand out and then you grab it and fuck it yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and just like snap it at the elbow and just twist on it and stuff you ever do anything cool like that um, not that I can get the remember. fuck off my show. <laughs> what is it? What is with nah. these people? Like that nah. last guest was like, no, they didn't use them as slip and slides. No, that isn't a guy jacking off. And then this guy's like, no, I haven't. I never yeah, go. Abused. Now it's <laughs> my feeding time. <laughs> yeah. so Rip their hands. Yeah. yeah. Like, Eat their oh, fingers and what's shit. even the point of being a guard? I don't even. <laughs> Uh, do you feel like mess with, like just being around them all the time, all these criminals? Do you feel like you might be like more of a cynic? You know, do you have like, like a cynical outlook on life? It normalizes <laughs> a bunch of stuff. You know, really? Uh, yeah, it does. It does. Like, <clears throat> but like I do man still... on man sex. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly what I was thinking about. No, but it like normalizes a bunch of just talking about the entire thing. Mm. Uh, you know, opening up, talking about the horrible things they've done. It just goes so natural. So eventually you like you don't give a shit what he actually did for a crime. You just say it, prisoner in your eyes, so that makes sense. It did it normalize white supremacy? What's that necklace you got on there, buddy? That's the uh Thor no, it's an Odin symbol. Oh, it's a Odin's lucky charm that I've had for gotcha. a long, long while. Wait. That's racist yeah. nowadays or something. Yeah, I was about like, to say, mu- mu- I remember like, Muscle Bus oh, was pissed because yeah. like, he's like, I can't use any like Viking shit anymore because like white supremacists have yeah. stolen all that shit. Yeah, they kind of they kind of stole that too. They, fuck, they fucked up your history. That sucks. Yeah. That's so you fucked took, up. Did you just take it off? He's hiding his power level now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude. Yeah, but to get respect on the block, he pulls that shit out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> back up, back up. You show like a little badge. <laughs> yeah. At your show. <laughs> Whoa. All right. Look at the yeah. black guy's eyes burn out of his head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, uh, you know. Oh, man, what were those prisons from like movies where they have the cell and then like the guards walk on top of the prison cells oh, and yeah. look down into them? You guys, none of that shit is. Yeah, where you dump their fucking chili onto their head <laughs> from up above and they have to eat it off the floor. Somebody just piss in there and fuck yeah. it. Right? Yeah, fucking yes. you're hit smashing the railing with your baton and shit, yeah. <laughs> making a bunch of noise. Uh, okay, so like, do they still them. get jobs? I mean, like how? uh they have to like work. average day yeah. for they have to work they have to work if they want to get paid if that makes sense so they get paid very <laughs> tiny like a tiny we're talking less than one dollar per hour yeah. uh and it's only money they can spend within the prison you should raise the prison what can they spend scam. Yeah, yeah dude well this is underpaid shit. like what kind of what, what can they buy with that money so like yeah, a cantina uh, like chocolate so like yeah. another yeah, child like to murder a, i don't <laughs> This is the most white guy podcast ever. Like, what is the inside what of a Christian yeah. institute like? What do the history buy? in there? What does this shit look like? <laughs> what uh, is going on in there? My only knowledge of this is from a 90s, 90s prison show called Oz, which is just 100% fabricated. Man, I watched uh, Prison Break. An inmate kills another yeah. inmate in that show with sharpened fingernails. He slices his neck like Wolverine oh, in that show. And that's that... my greatest <laughs> insight as to what's going on inside prison. You, you haven't seen The Rock? Come on. It's yeah, a little I've... bit like that. Probably. Yeah. Is yeah, this with... one on an island or is this one yeah. on? Uh, it's very like off. It's not close to any the rest of the city, if that makes sense. It's kind of off, okay. like in the middle of nowhere. So well, sadly, no over there. Yeah. Okay, so uh, well. you're the guard. You mm-hmm. see all the behind the scenes shit. Mm-hmm. Let's say you're in maximum security. You kill someone. Okay. You get put in your own prison. What would be your steps to break out of your own prison that you work in? Because you um, like it, once you're a prisoner, you're just you see what they let you see, but you you see behind the curtain, you know, you know the ins and outs. Well, is there is there like yeah. a security <laughs> flaw going on there? I don't think there is. There is one flaw, and that's just human error. So I'd say uh-huh. the best way to get out is just manipulation. Absolutely. Really? Yeah, Could you absolutely. be manipulated to let someone out? Yeah. No. No, absolutely not. Really? I could be. Absolutely not. 
right. you say that very proudly. No, yeah, I just know <laughs> that I could if they were just like really sweet and charming. Yeah. <laughs> And they Promise like me gave me time, compliments. Yeah, yeah. They open up the little hats and they're like, "Have you ever seen Trading Spaces? We should do that." Oh my god, I've always wanted to see what it's like on your side. Of the yeah. yeah. Hey, Officer Poop, I think you would look great in jumpsuit orange. We should switch outfits, Aww. and you'd be like, <laughs> "Here, hold really? this baton while I change into it." Yeah. I have it over my head, and he fucking starts beating the shit out of me. Man, uh, yeah, yeah. So speaking classic. of baton stuff, um, Please I was just talk- keep talking no- about baton stuff. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's very in the vein. Like, I was talking to my mom right before this podcast started, and you wanted eight or what? A goddamn baton, <laughs> yeah, mom. No, right. she immediately just starts rattling off like everything she's heard on fucking like Glenn Beck or whatever the hell she listens to all day. And she's like, I don't see what the big hate is about cops. I, I've had nothing but great interactions with cops. They're always so... I'm like, Mom, you're a white lady. Like, of course. They don't fear anything that you could be doing. She's no. like, if you just cry, you get out of... Oh, my God. You get out, yeah, I've gotten out of so many tickets. I'm like, I just told her, I was like, I guarantee you if I start crying, they would, have you ever seen that movie Crash? Um, and they pull that lady out right. and they like finger fuck her asshole right there <laughs> oh, next to the car. So, like, they would do that with a baton if I started crying. Like they would punish oh, me for that. Also <laughs> a white person. I, <laughs> no, I'm a white person. But I'm a guy at least. And mm. like if I if I have like that weird back of back of my mind fear of, Mom, of this person pulling me over. you don't know what it's like to be a white man in this world. <laughs> yeah. I, I, well, I know you it's got even worse. Easy. I know it's even worse <laughs> as you get darker down the list. Like the I fear could, grows. Yeah. I could get fingered by a cop. Mom, they would never yeah. do that to a woman like they did in the yeah. thing originally. Yeah, well, no, it was a black lady in the in the crash oh. in the crash movie. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. Which so in the hierarchy fair. of like fear of cops, like yeah, she's lower than a white about, guy. Yeah, yeah, probably close to the top. Which should be higher. Oh, it's right yeah. under white, white woman. woman. Is all the way at the bottom. Yeah. Well, 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 no, I mean at the top of security oh. of like not having to worry of about security. it. Security. Okay. Yeah. I was like, what fear? Yeah. yeah. No, no, no. I, I meant like on a cops. Uh, could I fuck them with Beard a baton art. in publicly? Uh, white ladies at the top of like my, you know, I'm not going to do that to list. <laughs> and then it goes down. Yeah. Uh, but uh, she, it was definitely a, one of those conversations where I just sat there and I was like, fuck it. Like, when's this going to end? Fuck's is going to end. She's like, they're going to release that body cam footage from Texas and it's going to, they're gonna all going to be scot free. It's going to be way worse <laughs> for them after yeah, that. It's yeah. not going to be it good. It's yeah. everything that's revealed is like, <laughs> it can, it just gonna, yeah. Worse and worse. yeah, wow. That quote from earlier really feels. Less timely now. I remember all that. Stalk, go ahead and strike that again from the past. <laughs> yeah, double he's, strike. He's it. never stricken anything that. we've told him to strike. No. I can <laughs> talk about a, shit I have like on the NDA, and I'd be like, Stalk, please cut this out. <laughs> and it would fucking be in the final cut. I he's was, like, I'm leaving this in, and then I'll put a little snarky me. words yeah. at the top. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever he says. Uh, he says this little oh, shit. Oops, I guess I missed this one. <laughs> yeah. Oops. <laughs> Did I do that? He's always <laughs> Did I do that? Oh, no. Do you remember that guy, Brian? There's a guy in Discord that got amnesia. Yes. Uh, that was funny. Did you see that? Yeah. Have you have you talked to that guy, Poop? No. No. He he's like, never in there. He's never there. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's this like regular guy on the Discord that he was friends with all those. Uh, he was just like a regular, I guess, that just talked to a lot of people. Gets into a fucking horrible car accident. And, and was it a car accident? It was a car accident, yeah. Yeah, ended up getting amnesia. Doesn't remember fucking, like, anything. Like, he remembers basic concepts like war and stuff. Like, he remembers, like, I am a human, but he doesn't remember, like, people. And so he just started going through his phone and, like, going through his contacts and calling people being, hey, can we have lunch? Maybe, like, seeing them face-to-face will, like, jar memory. And, and, like, uh, almost everybody said yes. And so he was going on, like, these lunch dates with people, and they were, like, yeah, we're not really friends. You just like bought weed for me one time. Oh, <laughs> oh dang! They're like, we're wondering Every why you. Every single person to list. I <laughs> yeah, really don't know you guys. Yeah, we you don't were really actually know you. A, just in case you get any ideas about who you were. You were a fucking loser. <laughs> you <laughs> you were. That's yeah. what we, we were just like bending his mind, like right there. We're like, you just kept telling us how you were like super into dudes, like and yeah. you just hadn't come out yet. <laughs> And you're thinking about it, and he's like, "What the hell?" Yeah. So they, I basically walked in. There's ten people trying to tell him how he should rebuild his life, and immediately I said, "Guys, guys, 
let's let's do this a little bit. and i started like suggesting even worse things but like it was it was 10 people just guiding we were just him along a bad, dude. Yeah, the bad we were just gaslighting him and bad saying bad crazy bad. shit to him yeah. why don't yeah. you drive and be like that <laughs> be, everybody wants to be like drive guy the joker like i told uh, him i told him robin williams fucking committed suicide by cop or something and he like believes me Hell like yeah, yes. I don't know why. He That's was the just new like, fad. Yeah, Anthony Bourdain too. Suicide yeah, by cop. Suicide by cop, dude. Yeah. You know, yeah, he always fuck. wore women's clothes, that kind of thing. You know. Yeah, all that. I yeah, yeah, what is yeah. crazy shit. Anthony Bourdain, I could see doing that. Yeah, Anthony I could see him wearing a thong underneath his clothes <laughs> for power. That's Hell the one yeah. that died from Death auto asphyxiation cop. or whatever, right? No, it was yeah. suicide. Not, cop, suicide. suicide. Suicide by cop. Thinking of uh, Jeffrey Epstein died too. <laughs> <laughs> kind of. Epstein died of heartbreak, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's what <laughs> it was. Heart. That's what killed Oh, him. I can't Betray. fuck all this kids anymore. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he got I'm chest so pain to die. That, that's what I yeah. can What do you think that island's going up for now? Mm. Like, would you buy an Epstein island? I yeah, hope no. I, I would. Count? I would buy that shit. It's a, I mean, it's still the, an island. Island. No. nothing a pressure washer can't get rid of. I'd the fucking just get a red there. <laughs> the vibes? Are you kidding? It's a the beautiful vibes island. Wouldn't be great. There are what no vibes because I've never been there, he... so I don't know. It's no, like, it's like at it on the, Google, okay, Google images. It's got like that creepy little like building, a little Egyptian ass building or something. It's like a mosque, whatever. Blow that shit up, and then yeah. you just say you're on a beach right there. I mean, oh, it's just, just a mosque. It. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's just a mosque. Blow or up a mosque. That'll <laughs> make the vibes better. <laughs> blow that oh, shit fine. up. We can start a fresh start. Nothing bad's happened on this <laughs> yep. island. I'm just gonna blow up this religious <laughs> site and. <laughs> There's a mosque on his island. It's like a, a fuck, fuck yeah. mosque or something. Yeah. Oh, it's a, fuck, a regular one of the mill. Fuck yeah. mosque. Only a fuck mosque in normal fucking. Modestly <laughs> sized, by the way. It's not that large, but I've seen bigger fuck mosques in my day. But like, <laughs> the place is so beautiful that I would think you could easily wash away any bad vibes it had pretty quickly. Where is it? Like with geographically. A power washer? Uh, yeah, with a pressure washer, specifically. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Even the grass and everything. Just give that place a good hose down. Maybe sprinkle some OxyClean on it or something like, like that. You get all the dirty out of there. Raid. the ground at this point. That yeah. island. Like, 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 I mean, it's probably cheap, you know? Compared to what it was, too. What it used to be, you know? I don't, yeah. Well, it's I don't know. It's overgrown at this some, point, probably. Like yeah. some sick freaks that want, want to get, the, you know, suck up the juju there and shit. Where is it? <laughs> Middle of nowhere. It's, isn't it, it's in the like Bahamas, isn't it? You're right. Epstein Island is. Uh, but real. like, but where specifically? Actually? South. What? Of okay. US. Uh, what coordinates? Yeah. 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 What's the yeah, longitude yeah. and latitude of this? Wait, remember when Microsoft flight in 2020? Like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, everybody exactly. was visiting it as yeah. soon as Flight Sim came out. It's to the east of uh, Puerto Rico. I remember seeing a screenshot that oh, was weird. like 30 planes I managed that. to land on a tiny island in Minecraft. Yeah. It was like the first day that it launched as well. It was like a bunch of uh, two hundreds of people just landed there for a visit. Oh, yeah, I see uh, it. That says something, you know, says something. It's popular. I yeah, think it, should, it, I wonder it like on the list. Now. <laughs> on yeah, the list like of a theme park. visited <laughs> on Flight Sim, I wonder how many people visited Epstein's Island compared to... I think it you wins. Know, I think it wins. Yeah. It was pretty relevant when that game came out. So yeah. Yeah. I, I remember watching like a time lapse of like most visited sites from 1995 on the internet until now, and like mm -hmm. as like monthly users, like the bar charts would go up as like uh, time went on. And, like Yahoo and AOL started out like king, and then uh, and then Google comes up and surpasses it, and then at the very bottom of the list, X videos pops up, and it starts fucking. Boop, boop, Blasting. It blasting and it surpasses like a lot of shit. There's a lot of shit where I was like, wow, X videos does like a lot of traffic. sites and shit. Yeah, like, like, uh, yeah. yeah, there's like some social media that's below X videos, which is pretty funny to me. But X videos fucking rules. Um, there was a time when Pornhub was king, but not anymore. They're nerfing There's... X videos, I'm pretty sure. What the fuck? You don't nerf, yeah. dude. Stop Game nerfing return. my sites, man. <laughs> I, heard, no, I heard they were doing it, dude. Uh, they going to leave me no option except for actual intercourse. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. Poor, poor you, huh? Poor you. Oh, made shit? Fucking There's, yeah. There's two islands, and they're for sale for $125 million. 
<laughs> and he, he b- probably he that. bought one of them in 1998 for 7.9 mil. What a what an investment! What a value. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, could, he could see some real returns. He could. <laughs> so, do you think the events man. that happened on those islands appreciated the value at all? Uh, yes. <laughs> no. I don't know. I mean, it seems like it. I mean, when, I guess also when he bought it, it was just an island, and then he put like a hundred million dollars worth of buildings on it. Yeah, uh, that maybe appreciated the value a little. And weird surveillance. Over what's here. what's the the value of that fuck mosque? Do you think? What's the, <laughs> I don't know. I don't, <laughs> does, I don't it, does it that, quantify it, that what, specifically? All the we articles are like, what is this? See. There's so many theories around this, like weird temple. You know, is the mosque worth pressure washing away? Is kind of what Sam's wondering. Here. I don't, dude. There's no. It? Is there like even a pool or anything near? I thought it was like a no. pool house or something, but I didn't know what it was. It's just out Man, there on its own. Picture picture I just I looked just it found. up. It is a mosque. Look at it. It looks like a fucking Arma Two asset. Like what is yeah. this? <laughs> this guy <laughs> it looks thinks... like it's from AOE Two. Like a little yeah, wonder. AOE, yeah, AOE. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. yeah. yeah, that too. Yeah, like a fucking. Uh, there's a elevator in it that scene. goes down a hundred floors where smiling <laughs> oh, pedos can so be waiting. Oh yeah, I see that. Yeah, they suspect it's like some sort the of floor bunker. Is actually entrance. based on the age of the person you want. So if you I mean, in, what else would that little building be Jesus except for some God. cool? Jesus. I mean, not cool, but some sort of like bunker. Ele- yeah. Like what's he like, like a Bond villain? Yeah, he's already yeah, he kinda, on the fucking kinda, island, dude. Just like it, uh, yeah. you, you know, everyone's got to know their role. He doesn't have a yes. single death laser or anything. It's fucking gay. No, oh, what a loser! Oh, what a loser! Where smiling pedos can be waiting. What? Like, know, what is it? Fuck! Is that a what bus? That? Like, what is that? What is that little thing? Is that like a title a to an article? It's, it's like just a, like can you post the image in here in this. I don't know how to post the guy. I don't know how to do Damn. anything in Streamyard. Dude, you're yeah. the you have like admin. You do it. Put it up there. Sam, go ahead and zoop that up for me. Yeah, I'll put it yeah, up. Yeah. <laughs> Why is Wait, he do... looking like he's fucking doesn't hear us? Oh, man. <laughs> I, mean, I, mean, I was looking at the picture. I was oh, sorry. Yeah, I, I don't know how to put the thing up there. Nobody no, knows. You do Fuck. No, no, no. I've I've done it before. What the hell? Yeah. The really great cool. mystery. What's in it's that like, little building? So it's like made in paint. This is what the building. It does it's look just... like an Arma Two asset for sure. Yeah, yeah. But at some point, you have to realize that you've flown all the way out into the middle of fucking nowhere on your little island. Like, why? Why even build like an underground bunker? Hello? I mean, it's wait. It feels so they way can too small to assault be, people. I don't know. Yeah, it's a shady island, to be fair. You know, I'm sure they had legitimate non pedos that went to that island, and I'm sure they fucking would hide the pedo shit in a dark little Arma Two asset building. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yeah, they, there was. I remember I was watching like a documentary on them, and there was this guy that worked as a as like a gardener or something there, and uh, he saw. Yeah, he acted like he was all righteous or whatever because he was like yeah <laughs> after like 10 years of working for him knowing he was a pedophile somebody asked me if like would i be cool if it was my daughter he was hanging out with and that's when i quit <laughs> Jesus <laughs> I was like, Christ. like it took you that long to like, figure, <laughs> like juggle the moral quandary of working on this for this guy yeah <laughs> hmm, what if i've me never was thought of it like that yeah, yeah em- the- uh, empathy <laughs> I don't know. Seeing a player game just, you know, don't catch my interest the same way as multiplayer wants to. True. Is that, do you think that's yeah. us getting older? Or do you think we just have shitty, like, ADHD Attentions. or something? I think it's an attention span think, thing. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, if you look what's Watch popular, TikToks. you know, yeah, yeah TikTok, for example, <laughs> they're like a max 10 seconds long. You know, attention span is just going down. You want entertainment and it's supposed to be instant, you know? So oh, why uh, why have we focused I, on making long ass long ass uh, content uh, now? Yeah, we we'll turn this into thirty seconds. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. yeah. like really uh, fucking rapid fire podcast. Just, yeah. Yeah. just compact, you know. One, just, one good joke. One good joke and <laughs> still only three a month. <laughs> like, <it> was, yeah. <laughs> collectively, uh, Patreon yeah, like goes back up to ten dollars. Saw a TikTok the other day that was like. The start of it was just a video, and like I was just watching it and not 
not really realizing what was going on and then it cut to a guy and he's like oh my like we are so fucked like there were three videos playing in that one tiktok with like a separate audio and you just like go with it now like it was like some guy doing like a cooking challenge in the top half the bottom was like an unboxing and then there was a story being told and i was just like watching it like uh and then i i like looked back at it afterwards I'm like oh my god like this is gonna be the new format soon it's like yeah multiple videos yeah, on one thing uh -huh. with like green text being read in the background i'm like jesus <laughs> christ like i'm turning into a fucking goldfish like you I, ever I read that I, book fahrenheit 451 oh god look at years ago this is this, like the bad stuff that they talk that's about that's like that's like a homework that's book like, wait what is like it about book for school yeah. yeah i i think that's that's the book where like the guy's wife has a they describe her uh her like day as they have instead of tvs they just have an entire wall in your room being a screen and it is like a constant stream of just Whoa. entertainment and I, his wife just sits there like just zoned in on <laughs> a better, all day. like an iPad. Key. A more historical yeah. example would be Idiocracy, where they've got like ball ball kick TV, and he's just like, oh, I I would like to be that guy. Yeah, so. dude, I bet you, from, you if you make ball kick TV uh, for TikTok, that would kill. Would kill if you, like, it flop. Would. Yeah, if, if you make any of that drop shit or whatever. Yeah, just butt naked bodies dropping out of cars. <laughs> That would absolutely kill would on kill. TikTok. Yeah. Like, I need to harness that shit, but should. there's just so much to go through. And I feel like yeah, we should make a Ford Fables TikTok. Yeah. Haven't you said <laughs> that a couple a of episodes? Idea. Right now? Yeah. yeah, I uploaded two clips <laughs> and it just got two it got, you know, it grew a life of its own. It got oh, too much traction. Yeah, Ford Fables TikTok. Check it out. Oh, it's, shout out. Shout yeah. out. It's gonna be International in stardom just didn't mesh well with us, I think, is why we stopped. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. More of a Once the paparazzi were outside the house, we were like, okay, we need to tone this. <laughs> we scale this back a little bit. Yeah, yeah. stop making these bangers. Yeah. Reporters are like, would you want to take back what you said about Epstein's <laughs> awesome island? Or, yeah. you know, all these things. They're like, what'd you say about those kids? And yeah, I just like them. I couldn't take it. So I deactivated the account and I let Stolt, oh, I I let Stolt start making uh, Stolt tiktoks mm. and now i think he just uploads pretty regularly he does yeah he used, used to be four at fables now it's just him doing dances and shit yeah mm. now it's really like, yeah yeah, yeah no. he's doing little <laughs> trends and stuff and he does book reviews yeah there. no you're kidding you're joking i don't think i've ever seen what salt even looks like oh uh, dude nobody does like the doja cat dances better yeah. than him oh yeah stalls. for real yeah it's He's as great. hot as the original when he does. Oh, yeah. His commitment to wearing the the outfits that mm -hmm. match the music videos is pretty good. <laughs> yeah. It makes me not feel bad cutting him that paycheck every month. Brian, <laughs> on the other hand, really just oh, seems to God. squander his. He has not worn a sexy outfit for me. He hasn't Do uploaded gotta... any TikToks. Oh, look, he's in an Airbnb in the mountains. Yeah, he's living like, his I'm, best I'm life. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck like, that, him. dude. I, I pay Poob, and Poob's like, check out this boar head I bought. And I'm like, hell yes. <laughs> <laughs> This is shit that I know. If I spent my money, if that money right. just stayed with me, and I bought a boar's head, Abby would check, fucking hey, Sam, beat me out. This. <laughs> like living vicariously through boobs purchases. Check out this fixed air conditioner you got me, Sam. Awesome, Hell thanks. Yeah, I can drive Sam. my car now. Woo, fucking sweet, dude. That is that is depressing. We were talking about that like last night or whatever. Was you, you having to? How much was it to repair the AC in your car? Uh, the guy. Uh, well, the first place. Was trying to ass rape me, so this other guy is quoting me for like thirteen hundred. Thirteen hundred, a lot less than to, what the in other the middle of me. summer too. That's yeah. 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 I, I just, think my Freon might be low. Yeah. Someone told me that the other day. I've That's the easiest thing it. to fix, That's, but no, it's going to cost what sixty, seventy bucks or something. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, That's I, comparable. <laughs> I think if you don't want to do it, like, yeah, it's like $100 for them to empty out their remaining and then put new shit in or something. Or you oh. could get one of those cool little fans that bus drivers have. Oh. Yeah, and put little oh. ice cubes yeah. in there. A little cheap. Clamp to your steering wheel. Yeah. One of those Disneyland spray bottles with the <laughs> fan. Those things rock. Those yeah. are pretty badass. Yeah, not just so driving with cool. one hand, with <laughs> fan in the other. Uh, I can't mm. see. There's water <laughs> yeah. everywhere. Yeah. Dude, it is... 99 degrees right now outside 
and I'm the farther torture. north. Uh, like I'm way. Was that in Fahrenheit? Cooler than, oh, in than Orlando. Oh, right? no idea. Yeah. It's but, 33 Celsius right now. What's that? Let's see. It's 91. So yeah, it's about what you have. Or something, yeah. Right. Imagine how many. Like, do you think anybody's gonna die of heat stroke in in Disneyland today? Disney Absolutely, World. Absolutely, for sure. There's all people yeah. fucking crawling yeah, over probably. that place. I'd reckon like, 20. Don't they like charge 20 20 for water today or Disney World? Yeah. yeah they all the old people fucking Aquafina. Bringing their grandkids baked onto the, out of onto the asphalt. Spray fans and they're just going to start fucking <laughs> They're going to do the last spray and it's going yeah. to be out of water. These out. <laughs> yeah. There's going to be a fucking riot for them. <laughs> All, all the rich will be in the castle or whatever with their fucking fans and people are going to bust through the Epcot fucking is like way better I'm going to go through the animal kingdom like the little patio where the drafts walk up I'm going to run up a drafts back into a bedroom <laughs> 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 fucking take all their shit like, uh, fire bomb it get, get, get all the animals too have you guys ever have you ever been to Disney World? Yeah, no. I went yeah, like no. a I, I was there like four, a, so no. last year <laughs> really? I remember that at Disney Cruise, I went on. Oh yeah, Did yeah, you, yeah. That's great. We stayed yeah. at is that Animal Disney Kingdom. World or is that a cruise? Okay. Well, we stayed at Animal Kingdom shit, for like right? days before. That's bad. Not the same shit. Once at sea, and uh, was a lot what, creepier. And just what's your go. favorite? What's your favorite zone? Um, probably the Bone Zone. My bedroom when my parents <laughs> yeah. aren't there. Uh, I don't know. I liked the, uh, like the uh the like jungle one the animal is it just animal kingdom i can't yeah. remember but there's like birds flying around and shit and they had a yeti there and they had i think avatar world there which had the best rides so wow they have the the blue people from avatar yeah the navi oh I they have them caged up yeah you get to <laughs> fucking get a baton you get to bang on it yeah. they give you a cattle prod yeah, yeah. yeah if their fingers wrap around in the cell you get to bash them <laughs> Yeah, I did that. I honestly, as much fun as people were having with that part, I didn't really totally love that. Um, it's all anyway, about Epcot, man. You get to like shoot Epcot. one of their horses in front of them that they're bonded with. <laughs> yeah. You get to you get to pull their ponytails apart. That part was a little intense. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're linked for love. <laughs> Watch the, yeah. the happiness drain from well, their eyes. You keep them linked, so when you beat one of them, they both feel it with the beat. <laughs> <laughs> when you come with them, you cut them off. Yeah. Yeah, that Jesus part was Christ, a little dude. intense for the family, but I lost myself there. I became just like one of the fucking Marines. That That's movie. why you're there to lose yourself. It's another world, yeah. you know? It is. They, it is. Yeah. They do anything to cultivate that, you know, that experience, so. They, I just they, can't wait until I'm old enough to go with my kids and then go uh, hit up every single fucking bar at like the travel the world part of Disney World. Travel the world. Yeah, there, I don't know there's like a part there. where it's like little little America or whatever, and it's oh, like, really. And wow. you go there, and of course, like what what's like the American thing? They give you turkey legs, cheeseburger. <laughs> yeah, cheeseburger, <laughs> turkey legs. I'm like nobody eats fucking turkey legs ever in the U.S., but whatever. Maybe corn dogs or something. Yeah, get. that's pretty but American. Yeah. You can go corn to like the dogs, different yeah. little areas and get like beer from those locales, so you can get like. That's you know, little Sweden. A, yeah, I don't. I don't know if Sweden <laughs> is represented there. I think. No, I think Germany is. Sure. I mean, they should have it in no, every country. Probably every country. Every country. Two hundred and something. Yeah, like that would be sweet. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sure everybody's gonna be going to the fucking Congo bar or whatever. Check it out. Yeah, see, see what they Camel got. meat and all that stuff. See what, they, yeah. see what Brunei has to offer. Like, there's just some countries that fucking suck, and we need to realize that they're not. And we need to forget about to them. At Disney World, we need to let them fade into obscurity. <laughs> yeah, you want to take them over? You take them over. Uh, I, you know what the fucked up thing about Disney is? It's like it's already so goddamn expensive. Yeah, and then that those Avatar rides, you have to pay. An extra fee on top of your ticket? No. Yeah, Dude. you have wow, to pay. So you have to pay like per ride for them. <laughs> and on the okay, so fast pass totally worth it. Really, not as expensive as I thought. How but fast they, is the fast pass? You yeah, schedule like you schedule like I will come at noon, and then you just go basically right in. It's oh. fast. Okay. What, it's uh, what about fast. per ride? Ooh. What do you mean? <laughs> I like because uh, like the whole shitty part of it is people travel 
from like Ireland all the way over to Disney World. It's gonna yeah. be a blast. Oh, We're gonna yeah. see America. And the then they Irish wait there, in line. I know, dude. They and stay in their own fucking place and shit or whatever. Yeah. Irish really said. They got like a fast and they, pass. They see That's the Irish bar the and they fucking they all on. congregate around there. Yeah, we just stay there. I don't even see any of these bars you're talking about. There's no. They said yeah. They still. They there's did, bars there. You didn't did, hit that. Like, that would have been like the thing you did. I'm there with my yeah. family in my little yeah. home. Like, my little sister. There. That's the time to drink. Nobody drinks by themselves. That's, that was the cruise. <laughs> yeah, the whole yeah, cruise. Sister, your little sister, poop. The cruise yeah. was just me like wandering around. Going, they had a lot of cool bars there. A little taste of everything. Champagne. <laughs> I mean, Sports how bar. Much, how much is a ticket, roughly? I have no idea. I have no idea either. I live in a bubble. Depends my mom, on if my mommy like, bought it. How much would a ticket like a hotel. be? Two thousand dollars for a one I mean, day. I wanted God. to go, but I'm just not going to France for Disney World. That's just not happening. It's it's expensive, especially it if you bring your whole family. It's fucking crazy. Whoa! And then they you got to the... spend like thirty bucks additional to get on the. The flight of the banshee. Are you shitting? What about what about the butter beer? Is it worth it? Oh, it the worth butter the beer, trip? so good. Yeah, butter God, they got yeah, the so Star so Wars good. cantina recreated. Did I, you know that? Yeah, I went there. Day. Oh, how bad is Star that? Wars area? Okay, so this is fucked up because you know I'm a big Star Wars fan. <laughs> the Star Wars area wasn't as cool as the Avatar place, and the Avatar like Avatar hasn't been relevant for like 11 years or something. Yeah, uh, yeah. but still, their area was like so much cooler and the star wars stuff was i got a i got blue milk drink it was like it was all right you know it, it, was, like just, Avatar it was like rum yeah well that was in star <laughs> wars world and um, everything was so goddamn expensive in the stores there and like if you want to build your own lightsaber it's like another like 300 bucks or something <laughs> oh jesus and, well, i mean they're not giving them out for free it's not a i know they're not giving them out for free true. but they're not giving out free lightsabers they don't even thing, work like real yeah, lightsabers they're, they're they don't like 10 bucks yeah you know uh, i did want it my my mommy did offer to let me do that but i That's said now save your money for the bar on the cruise well, I think you want to buy, you wanna buy a tiny little fan instead, you know, just yeah. spray your face constantly. Yeah. So you, you can get a lightsaber or you can get <laughs> all the drinks on the cruise and a little fan. My dad went to Disney World with his like his new family, damn, his other family, his favorite family, and his Not other fucking family. grandkids. <laughs> and they're like, uh, they're like nine or whatever. He went to no. Disney World and they got, they paid to get like the princess look. And he's like, this shit was hilarious because they, they these ladies have been doing this like all day. And so they just sit them down in the chair and they pull their hair into the tightest ponytail. So their faces are like Joan mm. River style, just freakishly <laughs> pulled back. And it looks like they're going the like, <laughs> yeah, it looks like they're getting sprayed in the face with a, a leaf blower. Their skin is like pulled way back. God. And then they just fight like like an old cartoon. They just hit them in the face with a big powder puff thing and put some rouge on their cheeks uh. and fucking wait, with their eyes with eyeliner. Uh. They're like, get out of here, you fucking princess. And the girls are like crying because their hair is getting pulled <laughs> yeah, so they hard. Got so much powder put in their eyes, too. <laughs> yeah. I couldn't yeah. close my eyes. You pulled all the skin <laughs> back. And, yeah. and, and my dad's like, yeah, I, I like, uh, I send them in there with their mom and then i turn around to like go get a beer or whatever and then i come back and like they're already out just like crying in the sun because their hair hurts because their scalps pulled so tight i bet he's like and they old family (laughs) he was like like, it was like 150 bucks 200 bucks to get that shit done yeah it was like almost 100 bucks a kid i'm like holy crap that place is a scam. Can, <laughs> that place is yeah, a it is. Scam. Put it really some baby does. powder on your face for fucking five bucks. Yeah. They did get like pictures taken of them, but they're like sad in the pictures because they've just been like, <laughs> they were you assaulted. know, yeah, they, they got their hair up. pulled really hard or whatever. No. Yeah. We're doing a good job of ignoring the guests. That's a real strong no. suit of ours. No, that's yeah. right. I'm enjoying my time and enjoying my stay. Shh, shh, shh. Me and Poop are so talking like, now. It's- yeah. <laughs> you and Brian watch. This is, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Brian, I'm joking. I'm joking. You uh, guys, you've been Brian talking a paid, lot you know? today. Yeah. I usually just get ripped and I go, I just stare at the fucking. <laughs> And I just fall asleep. Yeah. And I just start looking at other tabs and like, because as soon as they start getting to movies, I have a, I watch a fucking a movie a quarter. I swear to God. Oh, so when I'm they start talking about movies, I'm, I'm just like, all right. I start looking at random shit. What, yeah, what's I'm that stuff like, like the when we're talking about being ADD? What's that? What uh, what do you get when you 
are rewarded in your brain. What's dopamine. the word for that? Dopamine. Yeah, dopamine. It's, it, people keep talking about like dopamine. Um, I don't know what's what's that what that's called, but you have like a, a dopamine addiction or whatever, like and so that's why you wanna you wanna sit there and go through TikTok constantly, and that's why yeah. you can't just sit down and watch a movie. Well, you just go, a guy no, no, can't I can just have movies. sex with his wife anymore. I can watch movies. I just it's just finding like a a movie I want to uh, watch. I just like ugh. or I'll well, forget I, a movie. I'll yeah, turn on a movie. For two hours. I'll I turn on a movie, down. watch 25 it, minutes of it, and then I walk away because I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm like, yeah. I need to work nah, on something. I have something to tinker on. It's kind of crazy. Like, I love movies, and I'm getting like that where I, I'll like flip through. I'm like, I can't pick a movie for goddamn. It's like a once a week, like, oh my God, I'm going to do it. I'm going to watch a movie. All the other time, it's like, I'll watch fucking YouTube or I don't watch a lot of YouTube. I'll watch like TV shows that fast for it's like i can sit here and watch four hours of tv but i can't convince myself to watch an hour and a half movie yeah it's, it's like too no. much of a commitment yeah, brian deals yeah. with this shit every night where as as like bedtime comes on we get off at 12 right and every time right before i get out i i have like 12 to 15 tabs open of all the five minute to like two minute long videos that i have queued up that i have to yeah, watch before yeah. i go to bed and it's always just dog shit that I fucked up the algorithm now where I like clicked on one bodybuilding video and now I just have nothing but these. Jesus Christ. Dude, I, I think they're all gay. They have to be gay. They're so oiled up and like whacked. And they're, yeah, it's like <laughs> and they're just like look at each other in the mirror like, dude, you're getting so caught up. This is fucking awesome. Mm. And uh, and I, I'm just like, and once you watch one, that's all my recommended is. So now I've just I, been watching you know, dudes working out. What like to be inside the body of one of those guys? How did you get, why were you watching that? Were you just, were you trying to find the video of the lady that like pisses herself whenever she lifts weight? I think that's what it was. Yeah. That's what it was. We, we talked about that on Elden Ring. Yeah. This lady that power lifts. And every time she, she does a, what, what is that called? A deadlift? Every time yeah, she does like so. a deadlift and she gets up to the top of her rep, she just empties her entire bladder on the floor. And it's like a shotgun blast. It's yeah. like a bird shooting. And, and like people behind her are just like, is that an accident? And then she does a second rep and it fucking just, just lets out again. And she has addressed uh, it. She's like, it's a medical condition. And I've talked to a doctor. He says surgery is not an option. And because there's no way that my pelvic floor can withstand the weights that I'm, she's like world class weightlifter. And I'm like, have you ever uh, tried a fucking diaper? Like, <laughs> I'm paying seventy dollars for a gym membership, and you're pissing all pissing over the floor that. that I lift weights on. Like, come on, man. Like, and lay down a fucking gym is pad this? or something. Where did she go? That is it's disgusting. It's not playing <laughs> fitness. That's for sure. What did they? Not my gym. Do? And I'm pissed off. Uh, <laughs> they found like that hole in the wall gym from Dodgeball or something. I'm it's a, like a I'm amazing Joe's or whatever you know. Yeah, Pete's, Pete's gym or something. Yeah, Pete's. Yeah, it's like a, right a place like the that. Right across street from Globo Gym. You know? Yeah, yeah. It's let's full talk of more people. about Dodgeball. Dodgeball. Like, <laughs> dog story. That's more of in line with I feel like where your movie interests lay. <laughs> let's let's talk about the crazy. Talking minute. about the yeah the dopamine the or whatever. I can just sit there and watch a bad movie like anytime. I feel like, but like there's uh, it's something like, intriguing what am I about them. I need to watch like Apocalypse Now or like Moonlight or something. It's like, well, or I could just watch the new guy or you know. Have you have you seen like I think it's called. You? Epic movie. Have you seen that one? Yeah, parody. It's so parody. horrible, but you can't just look away because it's so bad. It's just train. something so charming about it. It's like a and train. It's, yeah, it is. It's Not the like worst movie crash. ever made, easily. Actually, oh, I was terrible. just thinking about the, the movie that I turned on yesterday that I just turned off after 25 minutes was, have you ever seen Chinatown with Jack Nicholson? No. It, have you ever seen like a, what was that called? Like secondhand embarrassment? Secondhand Fun. lion, I thought you were about to say, and I was about to be go. No, oh, yeah. <laughs> we were about to have a thirty-minute combo about secondhand lion. Secondhand lion, yeah. but sorry, secondhand lion. But the main but actor yes. of that movie is a scumbag, and I hate his guts, so we're not going to talk about that. Well, fair enough. Fair enough. But oh, the uh, secondhand lion. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We're on. We've we've definitely started like. <laughs> 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 that guy. Yeah, I don't even want to yeah. say his not name. Not Michael Caine. He's yeah. a sweetheart. I love that guy. Or the other guy that's like a renowned actor, but the little fucking brat. Yeah, I heard he was him. a terror on like 
for the cast to deal with. Yeah, alcoholic during the production of that movie. Yeah, he used um, to fucking <laughs> spit at the lion. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they caught him throwing yeah. bricks at they, the caught him, they caught him fucking taking a baton down its cage wall and yeah. banging on it and shit <laughs> hitting the bars all the way down yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah kitty 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 yeah. 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 you give its food on a tray and then just fucking tilt the tray at the last second and it would all fall on the floor oops yeah, Fuck drop, yeah. <laughs> I love that because the lion wouldn't even know that's like a yeah, lion like, like, he's just like what the fuck like, alright Pure oh, pettiness. Yeah. yeah, that's <laughs> yeah. the kind of fucking psycho he is, though. <laughs> Just what, you would do shit a, you, that animal doesn't even understand. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Anyways, I was watching this you Chinatown wanted... movie. Oh, yeah, and there, there's like a fucking instance. This happens in like a lot of movies where guy comes up and he goes like, guys, I need to tell you this hilariously dirty story. And then, like behind him is someone that you he shouldn't be saying it in front They're of. They're right behind uh, me, aren't yeah. they? <laughs> and it's Jack Nicholson, and he's just like saying this super dirty story. And there's like this old lady right behind him waiting to talk to him. And his friends are like, um, uh, uh, right, gushing, right, right behind. He's like, shut up, just let me tell you this story for a second. And it was just so like secondhand embarrassing. I just turned off the TV and walked uh. away. That was the that was the ending moment where I gave up on it. And she and was it was like, such a good movie too. And like I was like. <laughs> Yeah, her. her fucking water broke, <laughs> you know what I mean, bro? Yeah. After hearing that. Ladies no, it was, like, a, oh, sure. it was a racist joke, and I didn't, oh, I didn't like how... Yeah. What, what was the joke? I'm like, not going to say it. Wasn't even, I can it wasn't even what. fun. It was about a, a Chinaman, is what he yeah. said. Uh, interesting. I, I hope he learns a lesson in that movie. Was it an he old gets Asian his, lady? He gets his fucking nose cut. Someone uh, carves his nose up with uh, a knife because good. of the joke, I think. I wasn't paying oh, attention. Wow. Yeah, I think they remembered what he said, and then they found him later, and... That was how they dealt with that kind of stuff in the fifties. That's when the movie takes place. They just cut their nose. Yeah, they cut their nose. <laughs> mm-hmm. They were much it. harder on that stuff back then. Yeah, now yeah. they just write like a tweet about it or some shit. But yeah, now you get <laughs> a canceled. Speaking of movies and things being canceled, did you guys see that uh, Spider-Man movie? Just the nightmare for everyone involved with that. No, well, they're, they're making oh. a. There's been a fan fan film Spider Man movie that they've been working on for like years and it had a shit ton of people like it was crowdfunded. It's called Spider Man Lotus. And then like as it just got its final edit done. It just said the autofill. Spider Man Lo- Lotus racist. Yeah. What the um fuck the man? main the main guy that plays Spider Man, like oh. right before it's coming out, he had a bunch of DMs leaked where he was saying like the N word. And like hard R and like all this shit. And then apparently the director also like after that just, was they were like, well, this is horrible, like blah blah blah. And then he got shown to have like a oh, shit, yeah, that's everyone that's everyone and involved. The green goblin oh, no. actor <laughs> also I mean, had a bunch of like yeah, like <laughs> just like the three main people behind the film yeah. of that this thing that's like just about to come out and is has like so much hype around it. <laughs> are all oh my in, god and this is like, like yesterday or what happened ago? to separating the artists from the art yeah, yeah. this is my favorite <laughs> spider-man movie recent, though yeah, this is <laughs> <It's> like <laughs> pretty hot news right now but yeah <laughs> what happened to, i yeah i don't like spider-man but i like these actors what happened to separating <laughs> artists and art i'm not a big marvel fan. <laughs> wait did they do all this racist stuff in the movie was it like part of the role or was it their real life <laughs> It was Play. like in real life. I, think. Yeah. I hope. I mean, I, yeah. You know, I don't. Yeah, I, I like Spider Man a lot more than these the actors. Spider-Man movie, you know. Yeah, the Wait, R word is R word retard. Oh, um, this guy's talking about Einar. I used to. And this, these are old texts. Some of these are fake, and some of these are when I was in high school, and I used to say the R word and the F word, which I'm assuming is you know. Well, what's the R word? Freak? Be retard. Like retard. Be, uh, and geeks, probably. Pre- yeah, yeah, retard and. Oh, and reek. You reek, freak. freak. In there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Is that really that bad of a word? Um, what? I R think word? it's. Retarded. I think it's getting there. I th- oh. definitely think it's getting there. What? Just put a goddamn muzzle on me. I can't see that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at this. This is a sh- badass shirt. Now I'm not gonna be able to wear this. Yeah, hit him with the back. Hit him with the back of it. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see his back. 
Oh. Whoa. Oh. I was having <laughs> for the people at home like that didn't quite see that it's a it's a dog riding a motorcycle. You couldn't it's see It's a it. bulldog with a bandana yeah. riding a motorcycle. So, it it looks was, like a full moon. It's badass. You couldn't no, see it because of the rippling back setup. muscles. Yeah, yeah, get closer. Take off yeah. your shirt and show yeah. it. Look at that. Look at the front. Okay. Damn. That's just a, a wrench and a hot. It's a full <laughs> it a back wrench, Yeah. Yeah. That's the app. So what, the entree is on the back. <laughs> What do they do? $5? What is dollars? Yeah. yeah. Thrift find. Have you heard okay. about that Ezra Miller guy? What did um, he say something he, fucking racist or something? No, no, this guy it's this guy they, played the but yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, they, uh, is he this guy? Or are they oh. Yeah. And then okay, it, never, I mean it's like now that these there's all these comments too. All the top comment on every Ezra Miller thing. I see the same argument where Someone will go like, he's a fucking it's psycho. And then someone will be like, well, it's okay. Well, they go by they. And the, they, they always, are a psycho. They, yeah, they're like, they are insane. <laughs> and then someone will be like, they lost their right to have preference. Or like, Wait, he what doesn't happen? deserve to have preference. Pronouns. When I see this argument, yeah. like, uh, recently, like it's thing? every fucking, yeah. People no, are it's like, just funny for like the past week, he's been just MIA, right? Like they can't find him in a warrant out for his arrest, and he's just gone. Wait, for his arrest, what did he Wait, do? What? Yeah, what did he I thought? Do? He, I what thought happened? he was like, I thought he had a warrant out, and he was just like on the lam or something. They've just shit. done like a ton of shit. I mean, it's like a oh. mil. It's been in the news for like a two months straight of just yeah. like different things coming out that they've done. Yeah, he's been like grooming people or something allegedly. But what's funny is like oh. the uh, Warner Brothers, who's making the Flash movie, <laughs> only three days ago they were like, okay. There might be a, a flash problem. There might be a problem with the actor that we have. There might be a problem with this person. But it just it was funny that they stayed quiet for so long while the every it was like headlines was about this, uh about them. Well at first it was like just basic speculation. insanity and mm. doing no, not speculation. Like they were they were at a hostel in Hawaii and said they were gonna kill someone. Like it was just like baseline. You know, like this person's fucking nuts, and then all the grooming stuff came out like a week ago or something. Oh, um, and now they're like, "Oh man, I can excuse, you know, murder." And now we gotta. <laughs> and also, it's like, I don't know, how is this movie still coming out? Really? Did they like, put millions of dollars into it now? Yeah, they're like, yeah, active, probably... they're, I know, but they're like actively on the run right now. Like, <laughs> yeah. And w it's like all the shit Maybe, people you talk about. Come too, watch like, his own movie. Will Smith, yeah, like, all his the Will Smith cinema projects like... got shut down because of that slap. And this person literally is like on the lam, and their movie is gonna come out and make like millions of dollars. It's, I mean, you know, it's free publicity, really. I think they're you know making a buck just uh, because yeah. he's wanted. I feel like yeah. a lot of. A lot I of hate people. watch him. Yeah, exactly. I don't think maybe people didn't hate. I guess they did. I, Morbius like did decent. That's different. Jared Leto's so, yeah, a. he's not wanted. <laughs> that guy's gonna bore you to death. He didn't have any crazy stories, does he? Jared Leto, Leto. <laughs> oh, didn't he have a call, a sex call? Yeah, he's Jared got like Leto? probably all sorts yeah. of nice. Yeah, he's shit. a funky guy. Yeah, he's a funky guy. Uh, funky, that's, that's yeah, nice. that's a good way. Uh, he's very funky. <laughs> Yeah, he's got like there, a sex cult. Sam's just absorbing all yeah, sorts just, of information. Dude, I, I am reading about, reading about on Vanity Fair's website right now, and they're uh, they're talking about the um, apparently is it Warner Brothers? Yeah, Warner Brothers is just they're not saying shit because they're like about to release the movie and they're like, I hope it blows over. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like if we don't say shit, maybe not. If they find many him people... and he's innocent or something. Well, that's, there's that's a lot of a smart way to go between, about it. Hell yeah. yeah that and the Spider Man movie. Right? Just like the main actor just totally fucking blowing it right before <laughs> it comes out. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, man. Yeah, I'd be like, oh, uh oh. If I was in their <laughs> shoes, I'd be like, oh. Shit. Did I do that? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> little old me. <laughs> and dude, say what you want about uh, Ezra. They got a fucking killer fit going on in this picture. All right, let's oh, see. Let's it. see. It. It's like. Uh, have you seen their toe picture? No, I have not. Look up Ezra Miller feet. 
It's, it's disgusting. It's like a yeah, fur yeah, jacket with a skull necklace. Oh, I've got a fur jacket. It's like a fucking Mardi what Gras necklace. Fuck? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that guy's uh, the Flash? They are the Flash, thing. Brian. Oh, it's Jesus they? Fucking good. What? Oh, what are you living there so fucking 20 times? I wasn't yeah. fucking. You think I paid attention to that shit? I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> what the Okay, so. Okay, they. They. Yeah. So oh, they. The they I guess I'll say they. <laughs> I get, oh, oh, yeah. If you know, you beat it's me. It's hard to right, word into a submission. sentence. You have to change things about the way you speak. In my mind, like, the mind comes up with the idea before cool the letters. mouth can construct uh, it. Okay. Yeah. Two letters to this word. Fuck! No, no, no. no. <laughs> like, like, you. you for for specifically the non-binary, like you have right? to change the like the sentence structure changes, doesn't it? For they, not really. Like, I, thought, I know some languages. He did it. They did it. It's like not. Like, and how do you know I wasn't seems using like you're like, addressing like, plural? Is what I know. I wasn't yeah. using like the the you, unisex guy. Like, hey guys, what's up? You say that to chicks. You sometimes still too say they about God. one person. Sometimes. No, no. You, yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah. I'm you saying can. it does It'll make sense, but to, in my mind, I think like. You, you're addressing like a crowd of yeah, people. Well, you're old. Yeah, so I think you're on your way like, out anyway. Majority of languages, it just doesn't work because you know gendered words and such. But yeah. I think it kind of works in English. Yeah. Uh, compared to, so you know, kind of not an Spanish excuse compared to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like German, that kind of stuff. Yeah, but that would get confusing with Spanish, like conjugation stuff for that. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't think that one through. Or maybe yeah. you just use uh, formal. Like we should just we should ban Spanish, honestly, for being so uh, just get it out of here. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we should create yeah. like a oh, universal what? language for everybody. We're gonna cancel Spanish. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> one language, one nation. <laughs> as long God. as it's not like Mandarin or something. American. <laughs> If we do a democracy thing and we all vote for a universal language, I'm pretty <laughs> sure we. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to have yeah, the like, okay, draw English. A fucking painting we every split time. the so world right in out. half. Yeah. All right, there's English on one hemisphere, the other hemisphere is like Mandarin or something. The shit. Chinese guys, yeah, Mandarin, yeah. Um, Cantonese or whatever. That would, yeah. I can imagine how hard that backfire if you're like bring it to the world congress like i think we should have one language and then you get outvoted <laughs> like, english <laughs> we, we outvoted so hard like there's like a yeah, way yeah. way higher population but over there guys english yeah. is like also really hard to learn too and like it's complicated come on dude it, 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 even english. if you're the you dumbest change. motherfucker in the world like if you can write in chinese like you've oh my god like that, I, that is such an insane even so the dumbest work. sentence it's in Chinese so looks so much more sophisticated and cool yeah, than like yeah. Shakespeare in English. I have a friend, <laughs> Mike, that he was raised in China for like. Also, I don't fully get it. Well, His he dad, that, you know I'm pretty saying? sure, is a dentist who moved to China for work or something. They have a lot a of teeth kid. over there. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah there's yeah. way probably, more teeth. Yeah, a they have like teeth, two rows of teeth lot. for top and oh. bottom. Yeah. And, uh, I, he lived there for like four. He lived. He went. He lived in China for like junior high and part of high school, I think. And then he came back, and then at our college, took intro to Chinese, and just is like fluent and just blew through it. And I just kind of somebody knew got him. an Amazon delivery. What'd you get? What'd you get? <laughs> uh, uh oh. And uh, my new joy. Like one of my best friends was in that class <laughs> and just cheated off him through the entire thing and like. You look at him, he just kind of looks like a frat guy, and you would not, you I mean, would never guess. Yeah, he's just like, like Chinese. Yeah, like, yeah Mandarin. really good at it. I, I think I, that seems free low. That's it's, so, such yeah, an easy it's, A. It's Spanish kids do that all the time, too. Learn. It is, you know, no, yeah, learning French it kids. would be horrible, but like once uh, yeah. you got it, nice. I would love to do, like, I'd love to, you know, I wish I was bilingual. Wish my parents you taught me right language. Now. Have, you can learn I know it would have been like, easier when I was a toddler. Do you have like any sort of experience with another language, or is it just straight up English? I, I mean, I took Spanish throughout high school. And the, did it stick? I know no, un poco. <laughs> no. Hey, sorry, yeah, yeah. didn't stick a ton. Oh shit! What do you get, uh, dude? It is so dude, fucking hot like, out there. Like one, like super low res for you oh, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Been, the whole, it's because of okay. all the shit he has on his fucking. It's because of all the shit I got. Eye. Yeah, you got <laughs> you're fucking the viewers are gonna be pissed, <laughs> dude. The viewers, <laughs> you, know, dude, you can't make like them happy. Them you can't this. make them happy. They're pissed about everything. What is that? They're paying five dollars for what is obviously a scam fucking podcast.
Yeah, well, yeah, they, they don't. They, they, a lot of them yeah. haven't picked up on that yet. Brian Stoke no, cut that. So <laughs> might as well make a ton, though. You know. Yeah, Gump over out. him and say like, "Awesome podcast." <laughs> yeah. yeah, I Fun. can't believe they would complain about such yeah. value. <laughs> I can't believe it's only five dollars. That is <laughs> what a steal, dude. Honestly, oh. five dollars. The... That's like one Big Mac a month. <laughs> Come on. This is more entertainment than one Big Mac. How, yeah. how long does it take to eat a Big Mac versus consume Two one hours episode of the podcast? Hours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I get three a month. Uh, what did you say? What did you just open and set to the side? Yeah, it's not know, that yeah. exciting. Show it's, 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 it's for another production. It's for another production that we're running. Is it a fess? It's word? not a fez. It is not. Oh, yeah. no, I, I was asking on Twitter, is it okay for white people to wear fezes? Is that like a... What was the I, answer? Are, are I fezes so. like I know they're a cultural thing, but are they yeah, religious no, at all? Or, no, no, I don't think no, so. no, it's no, religious no. whatsoever. It's like yeah, but like a thing. tashiki is not religious. But if I wear one of those, I'll get fucking uppercut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, but you know, a fez is like fancy. You know, it's like yeah. wearing a tashikis suit. are fancy I think as shit. I, I think would it, wear the I hell out of one. I think it's how you wear it. I think it's if you just wore it and you're like, I just like the way fezes look. Yeah. That'd probably be fine. But if you're like. Uh, I've got a fez, and you did like an impression or oh, something. Yeah. I'm Moroccan. Yeah. yeah. Then I think it. I'm the little monkey from Aladdin. Yeah. Oh, if you start doing shit like that, I think I think it's your intention a little bit. Okay. So it's like, would you wear it? So you're gonna have to return oh. those symbols. So you just. Yes. Yeah, so I think it's get... also. I think it also has something to do with like how much regional impact does that culture have on your culture. Hmm. You know, like, like, for example, all these people have fucking Polynesian tattoos, like the Maui whatever tattoos. You ever see those? No. A lot of people I mean, have those fucking it. things. Oh, you just like tribal tattoos? Yeah, tribal tattoos. It's usually like and you don't see like Polynesian well. people going like, what the fuck, guy? Because there's none here. Like, they don't. There's dozens uh, Dwayne of Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Yeah, yeah, or something. yeah. I, on TikTok, Dwayne the Rock yeah. Johnson, I'm sure, is seen, like, pissed about it. Modern day people of that heritage like getting those face tattoos and stuff and people are like yeah. that looks fucking stupid <laughs> yeah it's like getting it's a my job. Culture. that would yeah. be great to yeah. go to like new zealand and then just shit on people that you see with them be like dude come on it's not the 90s anymore bro mike tyson much okay yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> lame so fucking stupid you look yeah. like a joke <laughs> those tattoos are fucking badass though those guys yeah. that do like the the tribal dances and shit they and they got like the full do a aren't haka. they the, the guys that do the, like, the chin yeah yeah, it's, it's like yeah that's fucking awesome the chin, yeah. and then they look like a um like a ventriloquist doll you know yeah, they have, like, yeah, the, they do. yeah their chin oh. the, yeah, if I saw yeah. one of them, I'd fucking put my, <laughs> my I'd put a wall in their mouth and idiot. look for the lever on their back. Yeah. 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 Well, I'm, a dumb, I'm a dumb bitch with a stupid tattoo, and then I'd get my head knocked off yeah. in one punch. Oh, That's why you need to become is, a cop. You should be a cop yeah. there. You can fuck with them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you know, uh, yeah it's my for. power fantasy. I'm making yeah. fun of people's cultures. Yeah. Okay, so, things that are different than me. Now I can have my baton and <laughs> I go through each of their teeth with it and <laughs> <laughs> bang on them. You have like a little Lego baton to do that. I, uh -huh. I, yeah, it just, that's a definitely like an if iffy. I think you could maybe get away with a fez. I saw a YouTube video and it was like, uh this this like white chick wearing a kimono and all the comments were like white people being like you can't do that like that is fucked up and then yeah. she went to japan and wore it and it's like all the locals are like a beat up <laughs> no she's like they're all giving her like so much praise and we're like we love see like because she did it in like a respectful way and like actually had the proper one and stuff people were like there's no issue with this. This is badass to see our they culture. Have a, it's the disrespectful. I've noticed they have like an outsourcing disrespectful type Disrespectful would be like big fake buck teeth and like... <laughs> yeah. you know. Okay, well, she wouldn't... Well, yeah, that'd be like disrespectful. <laughs> she had like a little katana and started swinging yeah. it around and shit. Yeah, I like, saw a documentary will. about like how people thought of like Westerners and stuff with uh, Japanese culture. They're asking them specifically, how do you feel about... Like uh, in Western culture, they there's like an infatuation with the anime and stuff. Fucking and yeah. overwhelming majority of the people from all age groups were like, "Hey, anything that gets people like exposed to Japanese culture is cool." Yeah, 
Uh, like if they if they appreciate the culture, that's awesome. Like the more were... the more out, uh, I guess like uh, what's it called, <laughs> cultural exportation we can do, the better. So when they saw someone wearing a kimono that was white, they were probably that's fucking tight. Yeah, like people yeah, were asking yes. to take pictures with them and stuff, and they're like, "This is so cool." Yeah. I think there's a line in like appreciating a culture where it gets weird, you know. Yeah, you take no, for example, like, like Steve. Yeah, like Steve, for example. Yeah, like Steve just takes it too you know, far. You can like anime. Okay, but don't make it your fucking personality if that makes sense. Anime. And yes. like yeah, anime have... equals Ooh. Japan, you know, that kind of stuff. Yeah. It's just it's just you have Steve on as a guest and ask him how many animes have you watched? <laughs> oh fuck. The now number is man, you fucking don't know that. disturbing, dude. It you is... don't want to know that. We're moving on from movies to anime so that yeah. it's Steve's here. Yeah. That yeah. guy has got a backlog. Not even a backlog, a finished log of just yeah. you know this what guy you should drops do? logs. Like we're talking like thousands or like a you thousand. Should ask him, you should ask him about anime and then just see how long he you know continues talking just completely shut up and then see oh, how he'll, long he'll go he on. We, we should no, he ask won't. him. He fucking and... won't. He, he knows we, we're going to use it to make fun of him. He's no, not no, that no. Stupid. We'll He's ask like... him and then we'll <laughs> just put on still, still, still images of us like sitting here listening <laughs> and see <laughs> how long he'll talk. Cardboard until cutouts. He, yeah, until he realize, yeah, we'll go do or some like, get, chores. Or just get like a looping like video of us shit like so he's still there. I'm going to go. By the way, I am completely disappointed with the people in the Discord, with just general audience of this thing, because we have ripped on Steve so hard. We had that whole episode making fun of his fucking legs being all fucked yeah. up. And like and six months hat. later, I asked him about it. He's like, you guys talked about me? For <laughs> like Nobody <laughs> sent it to me. He had no idea. And I'm like, I don't want to talk shit behind one. someone's back. Like, I it's funnier if they know about it because I don't think we said anything bad. I thought I honestly thought I think like Will or someone sh played it for him or something. Like I no, swear, someone to God, had to like somebody someone had to it. force it down his throat. I asked yes. him like three months ago whether or not he had seen it. He's like, "No, you guys talked about me." <laughs> Did you guys say nice? To forget. <laughs> yeah, you guys say nice things. I was like, "All right, dude, I'll talk to you later, man." Was nice <laughs> yeah, right, right. I got what, Abby? Okay, <laughs> yeah. I got a fucking. Is ran. You guys didn't talk about me having like a symbiotic relationship with like my hat and stuff. Yeah. Like, it's funny that Willard, Willard would play it because I feel like that trip was uh was a like, uh, Will Willard hating it, right? It was like a clashing point between him and and Steve. Where Steve I got really salty about it. Yeah. yeah, I don't think that they their friendship has ever repaired itself. Oh, that seemed yeah. like the worst trip it's I've ever heard of in my life. Maybe. Yeah, it's. Everything that could go wrong went wrong is what happened, dude. It's and just the jam packed in a dirty car like that. I'd fucking go crazy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> smells like piss. Steve, Steve yeah. insists. And I bet the there's just away, like anime OSTs going or some shit like soundtracks. Oh god. <laughs> yes, yeah, Steve. I can only have it. All right, somebody send this to Steve in like three months. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <Yeah. laughs> I played Valorant with Steve the other day. I think it was very su surprising. He's been he playing was, with a lot of with Omid too. Yeah, yeah he was just showed like up in that buddies. Discord. He's been and, playing with Omid. Yeah, Omid no, was you like, can't. Omid was like, "It's your friend Steve," and I was like, "What? You can't like, have yeah, him bleed like, in." Your buddy Steve and I was like, "What the fuck are you talking about?" And then I, Steve, Steve is I'm like, "This social group, know, you can't yeah. mingle with this yeah. social group. I know. I you know. can't cross that barrier He's unless you go jump. through me, the doorway." Yeah, well, I'm kind George. of the doorway. Between You're us. also a door. He yeah. should go it's in a, between us. Double, he can't yeah. go around us. We're like Western doors that open like that. Like <laughs> we're swing saloon doors. doors. Yeah. I'm the one I'm the with one the on fucked the up hinge that takes <laughs> longer to because I'm bigger. And How I'm the one that the cowboy hits really hard and every time. <laughs> oh! Yeah. Yeah. And How did Steve, Steve just fucking crawled under. He crawled right under the fucking saloon doors, didn't even touch him. I don't know. Yeah. I think he just probably begged and known. begged. Yeah. <laughs> and by the way, Omid is not in his realm yeah. of streamer. Yeah, he, Omid doesn't even like anime. And like like Steve's streamers yeah, are like are like the, uh, the VTubers and stuff. Yeah. 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 I don't know. We should probably talk to Steve that about a, this. It's pretty disrespectful. Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty I, fucked I have up. no idea Steve even streamed the two owners. He doesn't. He, he, he doesn't. He used to. Used to? Yeah. No. I don't think so. Oh me streams and he watches. Oh me streams all the time. Oh me just got finished with a subathon. Wait, he's done? 
I, what? He's still going? <laughs> it's past I, I 20 that, days. I thought that was one day long, dude. Are you no, saying he's, no, no, no. he's doing like a subathon where he's going for forever. Why don't I don't like from clicking on this. Sir? I checked on him uh, two days, three days into his his uh his subathon, and I was like, hey, I'm gonna help him out and do like a little duos with him, take over some of the conversation, make it lighten the load a little bit. And he was, I could tell load. he was like dead. And then, uh, and then I, I checked up on him two days later and I was like, oh my God, he's still going And the pits under his eyes were so like, his eyes look sunken in. And I was he like, man, sleep? he doesn't, no. he doesn't have a, a lot of he life sleeps left. barely. Oh, he yeah. sleeps, he yeah. puts on the TTS where people can donate to like oh my talk God. through a speaker and people that's just horrible. be like four, 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 one, yeah, one, 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 you know, he's, he's on day 13 right now. And you know what the insane, the, you know what the craziest fucking part is? What? is he's he's got a cap to 20 days i mean my god he's probably making so much bank so like that is that's cool i i couldn't do this like i just genuinely i don't have the strength to do this <laughs> like two he's going, locks, two he's going straight locks. from this subathon into a creators club subathon when tarkov wipes so Good like you god, remember last time they had a die. subathon he was already like agitated <laughs> yeah. and was like aggressive <clears throat> He's gonna be a fucking. He's gonna bite somebody, there. dude. Somebody's I was gonna... ask him about that. I was like, when you, if you had like a fight with any of those guys, because you could tell, like, when Omid gets a little bit cranky, it looks like he's gonna he fucking to haymaker swing on somebody. And I yeah, in Florida. Yeah, when we and, when we asked for a Corona, not a tequila, he was about to, you know, fucking freak. And and I'm sitting there thinking, like, those two people, like, if there's two people I wouldn't want to fight there, it would be one Omid because it just he's it looks like a brute, and then two. Oddly enough, Sturdecki seems like he would be route. Yeah, he's he seems scrappy. like he would get on your back and like bite your neck. Like ah, like he's like a little, <laughs> it's like, like a, a little um, spider monkey. Like a, yeah, he's like wiry. A, it's like a weird cartoon. Like a little badger, or something, Wolverine. Or something. Yeah, rolling on all fours. So. Yeah. yeah, he seems feral in a lot of ways. <laughs> he <laughs> just feral seems like an animal that needs to be just put like down. Yeah. 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 He seems like a fucking pest. You know what I do love about Sterdecki, though, is because his stream is set up where he's got fucking six different cameras all throughout his apartment. It's so I've gotten weird, to dude. see, as the years have gone on, him get nicer shit. When he first started streaming, mm -hmm. it was like a Rubbermaid table and his, like, mismatched monitors. And then his, his apartment was so just bleak. It just was the, it was now just he's empty. like in a spaceship. And yeah, he's, no, no, no. <laughs> he's got like nice furniture in the and, future shit. and shit. Yeah, yeah. He's, got, yeah. he's got all sorts of stuff going on in he's there. He's got a robot wife now. Yeah. His, <laughs> his girlfriend still looks pretty pissed off yeah. about being on camera 24 7, yeah. but uh, you know, um, I don't think the the fucking toilet cam is necessary anymore. <laughs> yeah, 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 right under the so. toilet. Yeah, in right the water. The yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it up it's just oh god and then he slow mows the shit and piss yeah. falling out it's, just, it's too much yeah. it's too yeah piss cam yeah. Yeah. And yeah. And only just, subs like, see this he's always <laughs> feeding his wife like sweet tea and beans and shit yeah. like are you sure honey you gotta go yeah. take a shit Drink another, yeah. here's another Here. espresso yeah. <laughs> <laughs> more coffee more yeah. coffee yeah. Yeah, Here, uh, put this lab mic on you too i want to actually <laughs> yeah. Dude, yeah, if, if you ever want to do a subathon, we should uh, we should do one that's like uh, Airbnb <laughs> style. Minute like, uh, what do you do? Multiple. What about people? your basement? How often do you? Yeah, stream yeah, we can do it here. What do you mean Airbnb style? No, no, I mean like a, a house, like people they, like they house. do, where it's not like solo, but we. Have, oh yeah, yeah, a we could. Home. Yeah, game. And then home. we just divide it up at the end. <laughs> Everyone gets like thirty thousand dollars, and we yeah. just go there <laughs> and just go. Everyone, there, yeah, so. yeah, we could do really? like an un like a. 30 day caps of a thon and yeah, yeah. I would like I don't want to yeah, like honestly, kids yeah. and shit. I yeah, would leave no. during the day to, <laughs> I would have to yeah. take the, well you would have such a you would have primo shift and also you I feel like you'd barely be streaming you would stream from like 9 to midnight and Me? then someone yeah would have to take no the during the day to, day daytime oh yeah i guess you could do yeah all from i i could do the 5 a.m until 5 p.m i could take a 12-hour shift it's four hours a day do, that i can't 
yeah. be online and everybody well, acts like, like a it's fucking like somebody, eternity. Like, Sam's it's never a, here. Because like, everybody I fucking know wakes up at like 4 p.m. and they're like, Sam's here for an hour and then he leaves for the whole day. Yeah, that's exactly how I feel, dude. Yeah. I'll be like, I'll get on. I'm like, oh, wow, Sam, From you get five it five until early? nine. Yeah. I, I can't hang out with my own fucking kids for four hours a day without everybody oh. going like, Sam's fucking never around, dude. He's just never there's around an easy, anymore. Yeah, there's an easy solution to that. Hang out with them in the morning. Yeah. And then they're you at hang school. Out with them they're in. learning but shit. They don't need school. How uh, there's what three homeschool yeah. them? Yeah, but they don't need that yeah. Shit. Them so they're not sure anyway. way to have a fucking psycho for a kid. <laughs> yeah, there's little. there. I have like several little groups in my extended family that's that are homeschooled. <laughs> they're each yeah. fucking weird in their own fucking way. Children of the corn a lot type of times, yeah. so they're, they're like nice, but yeah, they're just they're, they're nice, meanwhile. but they're not adjusted because yeah. they haven't. They haven't been bullied. Like an abused yeah, fucking animal. Yeah, they haven't been, yeah, they haven't they been, been bullied, haven't been yeah. bullied <laughs> by a bunch of big kids. So they're, yeah. They're, they're like... All, they don't have the same fucking skin on them. They're soft. <laughs> I mean, do you guys still do those Aram games? I mean, if you make it to them, then you'll be fine, I think. You know? It's Aram's a few thing. hours with your friends. Yeah, don't you do like an Aram? That's, oh, yeah, no, no. I, I play yeah, games every night. You know, that's part yeah, of being see. fucking old. Skyrim dude. We have yeah. scheduled Skyrim game sessions. Yeah, man. yeah, that is, yeah that's yeah. That's part they of, say you know, it's so on. hard to make friends after thirty, and like I feel and and mm. I didn't understand like what they meant. And all, uh, my schedule has not changed at all. At all, <laughs> I have the same fucking schedule. My kid is four almost right. So for four years, and like from twenty seven until now, I've had the same schedule. Only in the past six months have I been like, where I have no time for, I haven't like sat down and played a game during the day. Cause I've been like working. You need to, but I'm like, well, I'm look at our job. You don't have to work game. that much. I know. I haven't put out anything more than I did three years ago. I looked, I was like, what the fuck's changed? I haven't had time to play any games. Haven't had time to do shit. And I don't understand why nothing's know, changed about my life. Why. The Soul only tricks. thing that's changed is I turned 30 and then I just decided, like, I'm just going to be a boring guy with kids now. And I'm going to have my <laughs> scheduled gaming time yeah. at 9 p.m. every day. Because yeah. you say, oh, I can play anytime during the day. But you're like, work. Yeah. Like, you still work like a nine to five for some I, reason. No, I, I work it like that because I sit down. I used to be able to sit down and just fucking edit out a video and be done with it. I sit there at Premiere and I'm like drool because I'm like. We like it's too so much. much for me. I was having like I genuinely was having no jokes or anything. I was like, Brian, do you think you've known me for now like well over a decade? Am am I getting like dementia or something? Is it is there something <laughs> going on here? Like paranoid I'm like, about it. I'm losing my capability it, for You're a, a video that it used to take me like a day and a half maybe to edit. It's a week. I'm just like. Oh man, it's sad to like see. drooling, trying to fucking figure it out, and like I come up with ideas and stuff like that for videos, but like actually doing them is like for me to like hobble around my office and get the tripod and be like, "Where's the little th three quarter inch thread on this day?" And like <laughs> yeah. setting up shit, and I'm like, "Oh, I gotta go get drop cord," and that's all. And then I find popsicles in the freezer, and I, like before I know it, I'm sitting there like standing <laughs> on the back deck, going like, "Man." Oh, this magnolia tree is really blooming this year. I'm like, yeah, what the fuck am I doing? Yeah. I, get back to where I just wander around the house. Yeah, I think, I think that's part of it. That's part of it. I think. I I don't Growing feel old. like a real person anymore either. I it's even like I don't work during the day. You know, I wake up at like noon or something, and then it's like. I don't know where my fucking day goes uh, when I'm not. Yeah. Like I get it when I go out to the bars and stuff, but it's like. A lot of times, it's like the other day, I didn't leave the house for like four days in a row. I'm like, I don't even know what I, what just happened. Like, I don't even did. have memory of what I didn't stream any of those days. I didn't. And I also like the other day I did a, like an eight hour stream and I was like, that was, that felt so goddamn long. I used to just be able to sit down and stream Tarkov for like 12 hours. I remember that. Even, and then the next day. Even, that's crazy. How can you even do eight hours? That's still insane. To felt me. like, well, yeah. it's because I was playing a game I liked. Like the yeah. first three hours of it were Hunter Call the Wild by myself, which was like, Ugh, was, whatever. Um, it's it kind okay. of fun. Yeah. And then I started playing Divinity, and it's like, I could stream this for fucking 20 hours straight uh, right that's now. That's insane. That's insane. It's the only I, game I like right now. I it's stream. weird. I can't even get in, in like into a game. 
anymore. You haven't tried Divinity Original. I, I think it's that what we're talking about, the like dopamine or yeah. whatever. Like, yeah, 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 I got yeah. like a crisis, dude. I can't even think of anything I've liked in three years. I'm kidding. It's like uh, my life is just devoid uh, of anything positive. Uh, <laughs> my it's something to do with them damn kids. Yeah. It's some kids. They made me negative. They're just yeah, I, mean, I, I, I think I think that's why like Valorant and that kind of stuff is popular because mm. the most you can wait in Val without any action is one minute and that's if you die you know instantly. Yeah. So that's why I think the problem know, is I so die blooming. instantly. What thirty seconds I wait, I walk right? away from the computer. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my yeah, I'm on my TikToks. <laughs> looking at my face. I'll just walk feed. outside. I'll yeah. just sit outside and just stare like a fucking riddled old old like geriatric <laughs> like this. Is that, is that like being older? Like, I don't know. Just sitting outside I, and like... I, I think it's like, so. awesome now when you're older. I don't know. Like, it's just, I'm just like, I'll just sit there and just think about shit. Uh, when we were on the hike, young for I woke up early. And uh, and I, I remember I had to wake somebody up to open up the door. I think it was you, Brian. I, I walked yeah. out the cabin. Remember, the door would lock on its own. Yeah. And I was just out there just staring at the mountains. I was like, man, look at the misty clouds up on the mountains. I was out there for like 30, 45 yeah. minutes. Yeah. Yeah. And you're I'm like, old. this is the oldest old. shit in the world to just sit there on the front porch of an Airbnb and go, damn, look at the mountains, man. Also, you know, How old do you think weird. the mountains are? That's what I was saying. Old people thoughts. Yeah, you no, said, think, this is the oldest thing in the world. <laughs> Not what I'm doing. Yeah. This mountain. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this mountain makes me look young. <laughs> makes me feel young. <laughs> yeah, I feel, I feel spry just looking at it. Yeah. It's good to stay no. in touch with nature. Yeah. I think that's part of it, because I just don't do that whatsoever. And I'm always really? walking around doing something. I can't just go outside and look at the sun for a while and then just come back in. doesn't work. Your, your brain just <sighs> rewires, dude. I swear to God, I used to hate like all that shit. Now I love it. Or like walking well, that's why you got that new house with all those like, windows yeah. when, when, I, when i'm doing my like three hour stream once a month yeah. I'll, I'll i'll be down here for like you know two hours streaming and i'll be like i'll be right back guys i'm gonna go get a drink and i'll go outside and sit on my patio furniture and just be like oh like i just want to like it's like i haven't been outside in months so i'll go out there and like try to soak up all the sun i'm always like oh. i'm down there in the fucking basement in the playing dungeon video. Yeah. Yeah, yeah and i should be yeah. I should be out here feeling the the heat in the air. If there weren't psychos out there, I would put a fucking like a, a like a porch cam so you could see that like be right back and you can see me just, just lounging. Just, yeah, just sitting. Uh, but they'll line up the like, oh look, he's no. got like smoking a pie. He's got Alabama <laughs> creeping bin grass in his yard. That's uh, this region, that uh, paint color, and then fucking oh, he's got oh architectural God. shingles. They'll triangulate my house and they'll be out there in my my porch cam. Fucking show their I, I would see them on OBS walking down yeah. my porch with a rifle. Yeah. Oh, okay. uh, well, you've got all I sorts it would be of tools. A lot less fucked up, but yeah. Okay, admit it. Oh no, I can't say this. Stalt, cut this. I swear to God, Stalt, you cut this out. You cut the like, fuck actually. out of this. <laughs> Uh, you know, I'm pretty sure I saw, uh, I saw like the other day where the Mexican SWAT team actually killed a uh, like a cartel monkey kind of. Oh, I saw like, that. Yeah, you saw it. Totally yeah, like of course, they have like SWAT team equivalents, dude. They've got like drug yeah, cartels yeah, and but shit. Yeah, like the... an outfit and all like the cartel. Oh, yeah, so yeah. Did you see that? Did you and then see he that got show? shot. Yeah, it's oh. so sad. Look up. They actually got arrested, believe it or not, the people who shot the monkey. They should be. serious? Yeah, they wait, killed, they killed a drug monk, monkey yeah. or a monk? Yeah, a a monk, monk a drug drug oh, I thought you said a cartel it's, monk. I was like, no, like a like monkey no, no, guy with like a prior haircut, like, <laughs> but also in the cartel. No, it's, it's straight, it's straight up monkey. like a little monkey with pack yeah, armor. I swear yeah, yeah. It's, it's like it's, it's so it's, the picture is so sad. It's, it's just like on the ground blood. It's so fucking sad. It's like curious George is monkey little monkey. Yeah. Tactical vest found dead after yeah. Mexican cartel shootout is the hardest goddamn yeah. headline I've ever heard. Oh, uh, somebody, somebody it, was like nerding out and saying like, "Yeah, that vest wouldn't even do anything because it has to dis it has to spread the shoot the one slick or out." Like, it's the... a fucking monkey. Like, I feel like it just feel like the impact would just <laughs> blow its heart off if you yeah. That's, that the, that's, yeah, that's exactly. I it. think like, that was definitely much. just it was just there for like it looks cool. Like, let's yeah. get this monkey yeah, I, a little. No, vest. I honestly Absolutely. believe that guy, that guy loved his monkey and he had a vest. Yeah, and he just didn't I realize mean, like it has to be custom made. Oh, order the baby flak vest. Like. 
yeah. it's smaller than a baby. It's a monkey size. Baby. Yeah, that is special like, made. Yeah, it's a pre. I'm sure they had a cartel. Mess. Every cartel's got a tailor Fucking or something God. that makes some gadgets. Yeah, yeah, and, everyone just makes a bunch of monkey yeah, armor. Whatever kind of their yeah. their Q equivalent, you know. And he's got. Yeah. See now, a bunch a of fucked up shit's gonna ass. happen in Mexico, just like the Harambe shit. You know, like when yeah. you kill a monkey, it just. Well, it's I don't shit happens, picture. man. Oh, yeah. It's so sad. It's so I know. What if they it gave it a little monkey dramatic. gun? You <laughs> like think it would shoot one? people on accident? Yeah. yeah. I've seen a video Maybe. that was a monkey with a little gun or something. It's just like oh, a yeah, little, you know, like, the, fucking uh... little men in black. I think it's fake, though. But... There, oh, oh, wait, that's a flip oh, one. Don't you know oh. it's yeah. There you go. Little monkey it's man. Little, it's he, little hoodie. Why does he, Did yeah. he die next to his fucking owner or something? Like, Who's the other guy? It's tragic. Why Why do they... It's Put such a little area else. that you would have yeah. to get shot and then hope it doesn't <laughs> yeah, still just it kill it. Yeah. yeah. Now, what's that called where, like, Take they... this picture off. I don't want to see oh, this sorry. little <laughs> monkey. <laughs> I want to so see the sad. Yeah. chalk drawing, dude. Goddamn. What's that called where, like, the, the bullet impacts and then the area surrounding it, like, the... the I guess, like, the energy transfer just yeah. fucks up all the meat. It probably shot all its teeth out of its That's head. That's what I'm saying. It's, it's <laughs> if so you small, shoot one in the hand, I feel like the shockwave would still, like, <laughs> fuck reach there. Just, or... Yeah, stop his heart or whatever. They probably fucking just put a shotgun point blank up to that monkey. Up too. his ass. Yeah, they cropped yeah. the bottom half. They blew his legs off. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no legs. Yeah. <laughs> his fucking legs. <laughs> they robocop him. He probably had his hands up and everything. That's like, his hands were up already. <laughs> They fucking <laughs> mowed him yeah. down. Sniper monkey, monkey probably died in the <laughs> like shootout. Him. Like it probably got a couple licks in. Yeah. <laughs> probably bit yeah. someone in the face or something. Yeah. Probably grabbed a, like an oh. AK. Where was this if like was doing a little dances and shit? And oh. they just decided to still fucking and it's just like emoting. Oh shit. Ah, poor little monkey. Oh, like, so, uh, well, you know, at least justice is served, right? They're gonna go yeah. arrest those guys or something. That's, they're gonna it's... execute those guys for what they <laughs> Wait, did. They're gonna <laughs> arrest the the people like fucking eye. with the cartel. Well, yeah, I guess they're probably weird, not dude. just arresting them for killing the monkey. It's probably for all the murder too. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, the monkey's the important part. <laughs> the monkey, yeah, it's definitely. <laughs> they, that's why they. That's why they're that's like the going points, to bring yeah. them in. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> monkey <laughs> murder. Yeah. I can excuse just regular people murder, but monkey murder when it's Not got a monkey. little. Know, like, like, you yeah. say you say shit about the monkey, and you assume he's innocent, but he's wearing combat gear. He's yeah, wearing combat true. gear, and I yeah. think he had a little monkey knife on him or monkey did, gun. Yeah. <laughs> they plant a little tiny <laughs> switchblade on him. <laughs> He just has everything just baby size. Yeah, they, uh, uh, they just release a Photoshop version where he's just got like this insanely large gun on his back. Desert Eagle. That's like fra <laughs> a frag grenade <laughs> belt going the, on. The yeah. fucking handle's bigger than like he's sticking up as his shoulder huge. Yeah, it's a little katana. Yeah. <laughs> he has a letter oh, opener not... that he uses as a sword. Oh my god. That's so sad. I kind of want like a little a little monkey like this, but yeah. I saw a video of a, a guy. It was like a homeless guy in uh, in like India, and he's sitting on the side of the road, and like a little monkey walks up to him, stands on his lap, and then it just like grabs some of his hair. Let's do it on this <laughs> side. Grabs some of his hair right here, and then just fucking runs away really quick and scalps the guy. Oh yeah, oh, I think I, I think I've seen that. One. You've seen that, yeah. and the guy is so in shock. One. He's just like, what? <laughs> what? Yeah, <it's, laughs> like he's he doesn't oh. go like ah, my scalp's gone because like. You know, when you feel pain up there, you're not going to be like, did that monkey Whoa. just take my head skin? <laughs> my like, scalp, yeah. Yeah. Did he take Run my away. head skin? <laughs> this thing just like scalped him like it was nothing. And I was like, oh my God, I didn't even think about it. Like these little monkeys, this uh, is my Joe Rogan uh, 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 yeah. part yeah, yeah, where yeah. I'm just like, let's yeah. talk about monkey strength. Smoke a little weed first and then talk <laughs> yeah. about monkeys. DMT. I'm starting to think this thing's the goddamn source of my problems. I'm it really done with is. it. <laughs> Yeah, I can, your brain's I all so foggy much more done. It. Yeah, your brain gets all fucked up. Yeah. I'm on top of it today because I had my my goddamn coffees and everything. I haven't touched the damn thing in like I over drink 48 two hours. Two lattes. I still don't even feel fucking awake. But oh. if I if I smoke, then I'll really be in the gutter. But yeah, <laughs> let's talk about how strong a little monkey can be. <laughs> yeah. Apparently, strong yeah. enough to <laughs> scalp a man. Piece. All right. <laughs> The little monkeys, they could definitely bite off your finger. They yeah. could rip they out a little hair. They have zero percent body fat, man. That's all muscle. 
Yeah, but they're, they're that, how much could that monkey they're weigh? T- Five yeah, they're pounds? Tiny, yeah. Ten pounds? Making sense. Yeah, they're they're tiny and everything, but like I don't think it'd rip my scalp out. Now a homeless no. guy is basically a zombie. <laughs> it's brutal. Yeah. So, it is, yeah. It's like, that's just like he, fucking they could have put I could push yeah. in with a finger and push into yeah. their body. He probably hasn't bruised. been moisturizing, so his skin's yeah. paper thin. My I use such a great shampoo and conditioner. It's um uh, monkey proof or something. It's got a little <laughs> image on it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Oh, it's a little call. image of a monkey hand pulling on a hair yeah. and like a big fucking like red X or something yeah. like, yeah. Yeah. like my, my, my shampoo has a little glue in it to glue the, <laughs> my hair to my head that way the monkey can't rip it out that was oh. my mommy calling what'd she want I, don't oh, know. I was watching the news now I'm all scared or whatever <laughs> God, she's always watching that news uh, now my yeah, grandma fell oh Dude. yeah bummer uh, yeah, yeah train wheels. Like is she okay? Yeah, um, no, she's in the hospital. Oh um, my god! That actually, yeah. happened, that actually happened to my grandma too this week. They dude, they keep. You know what's fucked up? My grandma has one leg. She's like eighty-eight, so she has reasons to fall. But when mm-hmm. she falls, she never puts out her fucking arms. Like she just, I guess, like puts her thumbs in her pockets <laughs> and just goes down. Like, I'm going down like a cool guy. Here and I maybe go. crosses her arms. <laughs> she does finger pistols. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. fall. And every time she just cracks her head on the ground. Uh, and uh, apparently my brother was over there dropping his kids off and she fell. And when her fucking head hit the ground, it just popped and blood went. Oh, <laughs> Christ. Oh, yeah. Her head exploded. This, yeah, yeah. She's got like oh, her, her, her forehead oh, just fucking right. got cracked open bad. Kind of like that guy who <laughs> the guy at the, at the riots and the cops <laughs> barely <laughs> pushed him over and he bleeds out his oh, ears. Oh, no. Funny if yeah, her entire so... head popped off and then he, <laughs> when he went over there, like it was just a little cut, but he yeah. saw <laughs> yeah, like, like a balloon <laughs> Yeah. My yeah, my grandma she she they fell. won't stop falling. Why? It's a plea for attention, is what yeah, it is. It's a, yeah, it's all right. I'll visit you uh, once I get a year it. now. God. Yeah. I got kids. I don't have time to hang out all the time. I'm sorry. It was really sad when I heard about it because my grandma fell and broke her hip, and oh, she's dude. she's like ninety, but the doctor said she had the bones of a seventy year old. And wow. She fell. That just sounds what like a, something nice to say when you know yeah. they're gonna. <laughs> and she, uh, she like crawled a little yeah, bit, and then like grabbed a little like throw pillow off the couch, and was just gonna sleep on the ground all night <laughs> in her basement because she couldn't get up. And she fucking oh. like got Alexa to call someone. Like, dude, resourceful. Alert. Yeah, no, she was I like, wouldn't have thought of that. Alexa, yeah. call, call help. That's way better than my yeah. grandma. My grandma fell, and then she. Her she didn't popped. do it. Yeah, no. <laughs> no, she's, she's, falling. she's falling with my mom in the house, and my mom just didn't realize it. And she was just laying down for like oh, two I guess hours. I'll take on a the little floor. nap now. <laughs> yeah. She said she fell over, and then she just like was like, I guess I'm just going to lay here now. And she just kind of like flipped on her back and stared at the ceiling for a while. <laughs> and I was like, Mom, was like, so you fun. didn't realize? Like, she's like, No, I had no idea. I was back there working. I had no idea. <laughs> then again, Abby could have fallen down the stairs a uh, fucking hour. And a half ago, and I wouldn't realize it. Yeah. She'd be at the bottom, clawing at the door. Brian, did you say she went AFK? <laughs> she just yeah, fucking she just laid there. I don't know it's like when you, it's like how you go outside and you can look at the sun <laughs> for forty <laughs> minutes. When you get that old, you can just fucking like four hours can go by. <laughs> I'm not gonna fucking walk anyway. anymore. I'm just gonna yeah. fall bl- over, and blink <laughs> back, and you're like, where, where am I? What's that? What was I talking oh. about? And then you realize you're on the ground. <laughs> Well, what's puddle. fucked up yeah. is my grandma Ugh. has started doing the falling really bad, right? My mom lives with her. Guess what she started doing? Falling. 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 We talked about this last mm. podcast. Did I? Because you're like, mom, you she, should yeah. be the one falling. I know. Yeah, like, what the fuck? Well, it, like curse, it's yeah. updated. She, they both fucking fell. Uh, like this is like okay. I gave you the the lay of the land last episode. This time, I'm letting you know this re- situation has not resolved <laughs> itself. It's gotten worse. worse. They've wow. both fallen since the last episode. Jeez. One of which has resulted in a hospital. And then my mom was was uh, fucking carrying my brother's kid and just does like this comedic fall into like a Victorian <laughs> side table with long spindly legs oh my God. and completely obliterated it. Like just, it's like splintered into a million pieces. It looks like a, like a Pirates of the Caribbean where a cannonball hits a fucking oh wooden God. something and splinters go everywhere. She your, just, your brother's just, the guy walking down the stairs? <laughs> she, she basically used my brother's kid like a cushion to protect herself from getting hurt. Your bones are young. Yeah. Yeah. They grow yeah. back. <laughs> yeah, she held him 
out and he <laughs> exploded through the table. Yeah, she didn't even lose her balance. She just smashed yeah, yeah. the table with oh, the kid. <laughs> she barely tripped and she just Man, fucking threw through. If that, if that through table it. didn't give way, that kid would be really hurt, I'm sure. But. When I went and grabbed my DoorDash, I shut the door on the stairs and I turned and I, for a moment, I'm like, I'm going, I'm going down. Like, just standing balance, I feel like it's getting worse and I'm not even old yet. It's like, I, I got it. I got it when I was up there because I just turned and I was like, ooh. Uh-huh. And it's like, what if I was fucking 60? I guess I'd just fall down these stairs yeah, probably. What kind of stairs do you have? Uh, fucking hard ones that lead right into a concrete floor. If I was an old <laughs> oh. person, I'd pop. Yeah. I, I have like I have like that, but added danger. I have, we actually got a Dutch door put in at the top of the stairs because I was just like, the the first thing that's going to happen is someone's just going to go careening down the stairs Ugh. because it's it's a carpet stairs so if you wear like socks and shit it's mm. just instant slip and then at the bottom is concrete and then right like 3 feet away from the bottom step is uh, a plate glass window that then goes there's like the guy got like a it's like a prank set up yeah it's like a prank set up. like it is on it will kill you if you fall uh, and right outside the window is uh, a pie where the, a big whipped cream yeah, pie no it's Banana a big pizza. fucking piece of coral like uh what is that what? called like oh, like from that fucking like reef shit yeah like a reef yeah. and it's like if you just touch Shrape it scarf. yeah if you touch it on. it just like cheese graters your hand like it's so abrasive. Side, this glass plate yeah. at the bottom of these so if, you, so if you fall down the stairs, you're just gonna like break everything on the way down, go shooting out the glass window, cut every artery, and then just get like skinned alive off the rock. And then there's a well, paint bucket on a string <laughs> on top of the on top and of then, the door. And then I have two logs on ropes, and they come down and <laughs> squish your head at the bottom when you're at the very bottom. All right, how do I, I solve added those this? To... I'll put in doors to the top. That will... yeah. That's like yeah. banana peels on top of the stairs yeah. and everything. Yeah. yeah. The skates get, and get stuff. Get rid of some of the <laughs> move the coral and shit. I'm gonna yeah, move like the window. That's the yeah, easiest we're... one to get rid of. It sounds like <laughs> you're moving the window. Out of your way the coral's to too make sharp. I don't want to pick it off. <laughs> it weighs like a million pounds. It's like a huge rock. Why? Why I don't know. Like, why? Dude, like, why don't you live in like, Florida? You know, Abby's like, you like. can't, we can't even let the kids outside because of this fucking rock. Cause they like, <laughs> we had, Olivia was learning how to walk and she's like walking. And then she went to go like get her balance and like, just like land. She put her hands out oh. and went like, Ooh. and like scrape down it. Blood hands. And I was like, oh yeah. no. So yeah, blood we got to move that. Blood hands. That's like jazz hands. Yeah. Hands. <laughs> yeah. Now imagine a grandma with holding a kid falling through that glass into that <laughs> coral. It would, it's almost funny. Yeah, if it wasn't, if it was <laughs> anybody else's family. If that grandma's just falling all the time in your mom, you should not have your mom and grandma. It honestly house. sounds like a trap. Oh, it really like. does. Yeah. Uh, What's funny is like they actually have said the same thing. They're like, you should come visit us more because your house is kind of like a death trap. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And, uh, it's like final destination every time they go to your fucking house, dude. dude. When, when I got this house, but every house in Florida is just flat, like it's on a slab okay. to the point where, because you can't really have basements, the water level's too high. No. To the point where, like, if you, my family acted like I was the biggest asshole in the world by getting a house that has stairs in it. They're like, <laughs> oh, you like, piece fuck. Oh, yeah, you, you don't want I have family oh. members. That are just either so fat or their body's so fucked up. There's like, I'm not going to, like, they're, they're like, I'm never going to see the bottom part of this house. I'm never going to. <laughs> Jesus Can't Christ. Can't you walk around out back? No, they can't because, oh, my knees are fucked up. I'm they like, they shouldn't, they should be seeing the fucking end of a barrel if they're that fucked <laughs> up. Okay. They, they, I guess when you're, when you're like over 100 pounds overweight for like 40 years, <laughs> you're over 100 pounds. Like, no, your, your knees and everything get so fucked up. Oh, yeah. These people have honestly been a great, uh, what, what it's like, it's like an example of what not to do in life. You know, is that part of your instead success? of instead of like usually you get like your parents, like your dad's, like son, you need to do this, this, and this. Instead of like that kind of lesson, I just look at them and go like, "You guys are fucked up. What did you do? Because I'm doing <laughs> dead the ass opposite. the opposite, yeah. the exact opposite." And so in like 2019, I started losing weight because my uncle 
was just so fucking fat he retired and then died immediately and he never got to he never got to fucking my uncle never got so to enjoy fat, he retarded died anyway yeah. fucking, oh, retired he oh. retired, yeah. retired he retired so and then just like him, died, yeah, like a, died immediately like, uh, and uh, oh, and l- like they're they're the kind of people that like take money and put it in a Folgers coffee can and bury it in the backyard and like they've been poor their whole <laughs> Shit, lives. Where did I bury that? Yeah, where did oh, I bury? Yeah. I'm like, just put it like in the stock market. Like, have yeah. some faith in the oh, economy. Yeah, uh, I'm not taking goddamn stock advice from you anymore. Yeah. Again, <laughs> oh Bitcoin, all this. Oh, don't fucking look at me. Don't start with account. Account. Even Warren Buffett shit down. All right, I everybody can't. shits down. Yeah. It's not my fault. We're collectively you down. And, you and Biz will fucking ruin me man dude it's not like they all go up all the time all right there is some down points it's all been it's all down it's not all down there's no way it's all down i had a dream that i looked at my fucking robin hood last night don't ever look at it no it was no in my dream i was like wow i actually have made some really good investments and And in real life though it's like couldn't be fucking further from the truth all these things (laughs) i'm like Man, sure, I'll try out this. Maybe, maybe you're you're like one of those ladies from Minority Report that dreams the future. Oh, events that are going to happen. I'm a precog. Yeah, you're a precog. So you checked your Robin. <laughs> that's you checking your Robin Hood in six uh, months. Some of my that's dreams that is. would be very you think alarming. Six it'll bounce back. <laughs> What's going on? Yeah. No, uh, six months is not going to bounce back. We're gonna, yeah. It's going to be like 2024 <laughs> before any of these, we get these Robin Hood accounts. Oh, fuck. I haven't, I'm not checking mine because I just don't, like, I Yo. used to check it in the morning during all of like, uh, like, because I really got heavy into investing, like at the peak of like pandemic paranoia. Yeah. And so since then, it's been nothing but positive. And I would check that shit in the morning to get a big boost of, hell yeah, dopamine. Yeah. All right, getting a couple hundred bucks today. It's like, old, it's like yeah. old man TikTok. That's why I started investing in art and furniture because it's a, oh, only it's gonna be worth NFTs, more than gold yeah. one day. Yeah. The, honestly, between that and like islands, Oddities. apparently, like yeah, <laughs> islands. We need to start up, investing in things Literally. other than stocks. Oddities. Very, I very similar to I that. You said there was like some <laughs> artwork you bought that not only was it valuable, but the frame was worth something. Oh yeah. I also like, bought one that I'm pretty sure is worth like four thousand dollars, and I got it for two dollars. And when they handed it to me, the wind blew it out of my hands, and it scraped <laughs> against the asphalt <laughs> and tore. Oh, yeah. and I, since I was like, "What the fuck?" And it's just been sitting in a dark room That's ever so since. I, I have so I have a lot of prints just sitting in dark rooms. So I think one day they're really gonna be worth. Well, they're probably worth shit now. No, oh, no yeah, some of them are, <laughs> but it's like. I don't like so I don't like selling shit. No. I don't like, like, so well. anyway. like giving things back. I yeah. yeah, I don't like giving it back. When, when, I we, died, when we got this house, it had a piece of artwork on the walls that the guy left here. And Abby, I, I think she broke the glass on the frame, and so we we're gonna get it reframed. And she saw like at the bottom was like handwritten, like the the, the number of prints and like mm-hmm. the guy that did it and oh, everything. Wow. She looked it up. It's like a fifteen hundred dollar print. They just left it there. Yeah, he's left it there. The guy's probably rich as fuck, right? The dude that li- used to live there? Because he said he had a lot of weird, like, cultural shit all over the house, right? Yeah. He, <laughs> it makes us seem really cultured because he's got, like, all this opera stuff hanging on the walls. And, and Bonnie and he left found it? in Africa. Well, he there. died. Of course he left it. It's oh, like, bury me with he... my posters. <laughs> That's Boy, the ultimate estate sale, that buying that the house when they're dead. No, his daughter's, like, she's, uh, she's like, old, old aristocracy type lady and she's like ah leave like leave everything and, oh, yeah the is, so. she, she had that transatlantic accent and she was just like yeah, come how on, do you go. how do you still have this accent yeah she, i swear <laughs> to god she's like the only lady with it still oh so you're not joking yeah. she actually... no i'm not joking she had a transatlantic accent what the fuck swear to god and she was like i mean you have i to can't i can't yourself. do a transatlantic accent now that i've oh, said it hey yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like she that. said she was like, uh, "Hello, my old sport." She was like, "You just, you just bought me a trip to Europe," and she just left. <laughs> a diggity. Yeah. yeah, that sounds just like I John Mulaney or like, something. Um, yeah. Oh, that's cool. And so now I guess she's she's gone, just so jet setting around. Oh, well, what a bitch! God, she just yeah. left all her. Fi- if I die and my kids are just like, yeah, whatever, someone else can have all this shit. I'll be pissed. Because <laughs> yeah. my mom is. Yeah. My, my mom isn't dead yet and 
all of all of us kids are always talking to her like when you die i'm gonna get that painting and you know they want this and blah 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 and it, but it's like who gets the house you have to run the family business so i'm not going for that i'm going for the chairs and i'm going for a couple prints the miniature horses i'm making sure that yeah i know <laughs> The horses probably will still somehow the, goddamn be alive. The, I, I think they're gonna. The, they've the been there my entire life, and they just are. I, they're just like a feature of the house. I don't, I don't. I don't. I don't think they age. They look the same too. I don't know. You tell when a horse gets old. Maybe their their teeth fall out or something. They they just collapse. I don't know. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> they're, they're, uh, do they get gray hairs or something? I, yeah. I don't know. They look great. Yeah. They don't look a day over ten years old. One or two when the horse years. I don't know. Their back know. starts sloping till oh, their belly yeah, touches the ground. When they get this sway back or whatever. Yeah. Well, and then it's like you're riding a hammock with legs. <laughs> <laughs> more more comfortable. I, I never yeah. got that was a bad thing. It seems like. And they groan like an old ship in the water. So it's like, it's way more peaceful. It's like white noise. Oh, oh. Groaning under your weight. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh, Why? It's like the yeah. I'm like a, the smallest horse. You put this big fat guy laying on my back. <laughs> <laughs> Can't you see my back is visibly destroyed already? <laughs> yeah, but we can get to sit in their stomach like I that. I thought yeah, it was a scene nice. roof. And dude, my, when I was a kid, <laughs> my brother. Like a camel. <laughs> my brother and I were like, hey, I, I told him, I was like, I want the house when mom dies. And then my brother's like, that's fine. I'll take. My mom collects some not artwork but like pottery and it's like a certain type of pottery that's Still worth artwork. something yeah and she she has a, a huge collection of this uh this pottery and <laughs> my brother's like i want the pottery uh, you get the house and like my mom was like okay like I'll, I'll remember that just in case like and she wrote it down in her will and then she fucking lost the house during like the 2008 financial crisis damn so, you got her scammed bro i'm like she what did your brother know her all she has is that yeah. fucking pottery and my brother has it Doing and i don't think she ever changed like her official will or whatever so, you, your brother knew something Maybe when he was yeah. like yeah, you take the house I'll well take he's pottery. five years older than me so at this point he's probably like 20 or whatever he saw the writing on the wall he's like man the economy's not looking so fucking great i'll go for those <laughs> I'll go for the pottery. <laughs> Might be able to scoop uh, creek water with that when the, when everything oh, comes collapsing. Can't, can't, worth a can't for gold one day. Yeah, yeah. Can't and for everything's a going of jars. back to pottery. Oh, Y two K shuts down the world. Pottery will be the new <laughs> <old> money, <laughs> dude. <laughs> you can barter for some insane shit if you have like a, a teapot or whatever when a everything closes pot. down. Yeah, no. shit. I could probably definitely barter off. Too many horses if everything shut down they would be yeah, worth like poop so poop has so many trinkets and knickknacks you can just I've, barter with people yeah, oh my god yeah, i'd be good dude. for a while i could <laughs> probably live for a week off all my shit <laughs> like, damn i wouldn't know i don't know how to cook or anything though so i'd be pretty fucked like pretty quickly <laughs> um or like i don't know unless doordash still i mean those people <laughs> still got to make a living you know even if the economy collapses and stuff just <laughs> stickers and shit uh, i threw up a little bit and just swallowed it second taste of my sandwich you just just for the thought of the economy falling yeah. apart uh, so God, it scares one. me so bad i've been thinking about I th it's too late at this point but like we're about to hit a recession a year ago i was like hey maybe i should make like a big fucking vegetable garden or something just in case yeah, that's one of them food gets super expensive because i have the land for it. i could i could do rows i could do a little thing yeah right Give Abby something to do out You're there in, in the hundred degree heat. If you, if yeah, you have yeah, I'll be out yeah, there like, why? <laughs> why can't I do more than three videos a month as I'm out here tilling the soil? And, like, <laughs> like, and I, like, I keep no. coming inside. I'm at premiere, and I'm like, wait, where are these <laughs> goddamn caterpillars coming from? They're eating my damn tomatoes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> eating all my, my tomatoes. Scarecrow up. not scary enough. Why do crows keep ravaging yeah. my crops? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sit out there with a gun. That'd be cool. Or I could just sit up there. In the scarecrow spot, yeah, but, like, like Jeeper in, Creeper in style, the, yeah, yeah, like stuck in it. And you're, yeah, ah, I won't move or anything, but just so I could see the, the, the patterns. Of the, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do the head turn. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, but seriously, the size of a garden I'm talking about is like maybe like 
10 by 20 feet. Like it's really small. So uh, having having a scarecrow like <laughs> five feet away from you and not like the Jeepers Creepers one, he's looking at it from like a quarter mile away going, is that a real person over there? But like if she's not able to tell, it's just me <laughs> from yeah. seven feet away. <laughs> she's a fucking idiot. Well, you put scarecrow, scarecrow clothes on you and paint, paint your nose yeah. red. That's what they call it. Yeah. Scarecrow. Yeah. You would do a little, little black stitch smile and stuff. Mm -hmm. They should get surgically stitched on your face. Yeah. <laughs> and then I would just tell her, I'm a scarecrow. And she'd be that like, would oh, be okay. scary if you got a scarecrow <laughs> surgery. That'd probably yeah. freak her out. Uh, <laughs> well, that means it works. You know? She, she yeah. unsews you. Who did this to you? I did it. <laughs> just trying to scare off all these damn birds or whatever. <laughs> the birds savvy. They keep, <laughs> they don't stop. keep taking my shit. Oh my God. You've wasted thousands of dollars to make like twenty-five dollars worth of vegetables. Just get in there and fucking edit. Like, figure out how to edit. The economy isn't that bad yet. You can still <laughs> yeah, order food. Fucking bad. If uh, four thousand more ye yields, it'll pay off. I yeah. Just... Oh, yeah. Oh, oh man, it's just funny to me that what's that guy's name? Wellen. He made like a whole ass garden and oh, grew yeah, like pumpkin. Yeah, he I made like it. a pumpkin patch. I'm like, that's the one food I don't. Can it's you so eat useless. pumpkins yeah. no, except for just pumpkin, pumpkin pie? pie. Yeah, no, really, just, no. and pumpkin yeah. spice lattes oh, and shit. Boy, like, I never thought about that. People, it's like yeah, the worst. That's kind of useless. Pumpkins. Yeah, yeah pumpkins useless. suck. He could have. Oh, he could have grown anything. Like watermelon. Pumpkins, kind of. yeah. He should have grown a steak or something. Oh, I want to see that. I want to see Wellen cut that thing into fucking pizza slices and just <laughs> and eat, like, yeah. eat, a, uh, eat it raw. Uh, a pumpkin. Because yeah. he, he grew the shit out of those. Some of those were like, they look like they could compete in the fair. Like he had some beautiful big pumpkins. Well, he's just really we, tiny. We, so they yeah, uh, he was like, like, like climbing a over them and yeah. stuff. To me, it would be like, like a bowling ball. Like a yeah. 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 Small. He lived inside one for a little yeah. bit. <laughs> <laughs> little windows, got little windows into it. Oh I figure if he has those skills, he could have grown something useful. Like I uh, think the pumpkin though is because that's like his picture. Like that's yeah, like yeah. his oh. that's like yeah. his thing is like pumpkin stuff. Didn't so. he get like famous for doing like a pumpkin patch thing in Rust? Wasn't that how he even started? Oh, are there pumpkins what? in Rust? Yeah, no yeah. shit. Yeah, they, yeah. Rust been around forever. I think oh. that's how you put them on your like, head. The biggest video we ask, if I'm not wrong, you know. Oh, oh that baby. makes there's lore. lore. There's was like, well lore. The yeah, there's lore. Kits. It was like he planted yeah. a bunch of pumpkins that put bear traps, it, you know, it, that kind of stuff. He was, he was a, a cabbage doll. patch kid. Yeah, he was he a little doll him. that came to life. <laughs> he would have a lot more useful <laughs> produce he could grow. <laughs> I think cabbage is a lot better. Yeah. Uh, cabbage. Uh, you know, it'd be a lot easier is now that I did that mushroom hunting thing. If I could figure out how to like do indoor farming and do mushrooms, hydroponic. Yeah. <laughs> To grow fucking weed down there and smoke the shit out of it. No, I want. I want something. I want something good. that I could eat. I want yeah. some some eats. I mean, some eat can stuff. you buy some like silly small boxes? Stars, can you buy like small boxes of mushrooms and just fucking you spray some water on them and then it takes three days and they're fully grown. Oh, yeah, like, you can really? Just eat mushrooms. All yeah, time. yeah. There you can buy more. What are gourds? Sure. What are gourds used for? Yeah, you Same cut the top pumpkin. off Hollow and then you yeah. yeah make drinking things. Oh. You drink alcohol and do kung fu. That's what it's for. I feel like gourds are dying <laughs> off. I haven't seen anyone. They kind of practical. The gourd game is weak these yeah. days. Isn't that so. like an American state? I, oh, yeah, I legitimately have a gourd. I don't know where it is, but it's somewhere in storage. Like a oh, like a dried one. one? How, bi yeah, how yeah, big? How big are we talking? Dried. How big uh, is it? It's probably like this. Like I can't okay. see your bottom like, hand. Like okay, like, like, probably that big. Probably Dude, big. I just you just brought back a memory that fucking haunts me my grandfather for a while was what? really into gourds <laughs> that are dried and then you you would take a hole saw and make it into a birdhouse you just cut oh, a hole yeah. on the side of it oh, and nice. then hang it and he and then he i think he had like a wood burner or something and he would like burn little designs into the side of them when he like, died so did gourd working in america <laughs> yeah with yeah, him one of the last boat. great gourd, gourd working. workers is <laughs> our culture is disappearing i haven't yeah. seen anyone selling gourds in a market he's looking, down on, me. He's looking down on me going like this guy hasn't touched a gourd he's on the legacy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we'll discover gourds at some point you oh, could grow a gourd so big you could make a person house out of it that'd be sweet oh for well oh, you know? yeah. Yeah. yeah for, yeah, for, for well little well hut <laughs> I that mean, it'd be so sweet to have a gourd, little gourd garden shed. 
I mean, put all your tools in there and stuff. Literally built like a farmer, you know. I could see him tilling the soil on all fours, you know, just crawling around. See him like pulling a fucking cart. He's Jack too. He yeah, can, he is. Like a he rich ox. Yeah. yeah. I could see him being like a like a farmer <laughs> in the Shire, you know. Yeah, just a around farmer. The pumpkin in the Shire. <laughs> A, a barber, barber in the Shire? I can see him no, being a barber. A yeah. farmer in the oh, Shire. Oh, farmer. <laughs> barber in the Shire. A barber in the Shire. <laughs> I can see him totally being a barber. <laughs> he's, got that, <laughs> yeah. he's got that fucking peppermint stripe pole vibes to him. A little song. <laughs> oh, shit. Whatever happened to those poles that move like that? Whatever. That was another. What My brother's got one of those tattooed down. on him. <laughs> what? Oh, really? oh, I Why? Feel like yeah, I, in, I feel like I... I've seen that in a video. Something new. <laughs> yeah. He has yeah. a he has a whole ass like barbershop pole tattooed on him and my mom sees it and goes like, Oh, that's great because your because your grandfather was oh, a barber. Yeah, so uh, yeah. And my and my uh, brother's like, Oh yeah, he was a barber. <laughs> like, oh my god. He just had a friend that was learning tattooing and he's like, Can I just tattoo shit on you? And my brother's like, All right, like free tattoos. And so he just he was like, I drew a barbershop pole, and my brother's like, throw it on me. I got hair. I mean, like, this, <laughs> oh this relates to human experience. Fuck. I grow some of that, so I could have been at a barber at some point. Throw it up there. Oh, fuck my barber grandpa. Yeah, we <laughs> yeah. should get adored by it. Get a giant gourd tattoo. He likes yeah. gourds. It's a big gourd house. It's not yeah. a pumpkin. <laughs> it's a gourd. <laughs> Dude, that'd be, that would make a killer scrotum tattoo. Because it's oh. kind of gourd shaped, and you get gourd. like the the I gourd the walnut. hole for the. I'm gonna get just a walnut shell <laughs> tattooed on my balls. <laughs> yeah, all you would have to better. do is the seam, <laughs> I guess, <laughs> and even that's already there in the middle. Yeah. I don't need to do anything to mine. It just already looks like yeah. a big walnut. I just, <laughs> I just tell girls, they're like, "Do you have any tattoos? I have one, but it's pretty yeah. out there. It's pretty out there. You're gonna have to go on a date in order to see it. Yeah, and they're so curious. That's hook, line, and sinker at that point. Well, it's a good pick of mine, you know. Yeah, yeah. You mean my the ball wall, pit, the Chuck my e. Cheese? I'll show you it. Yeah, it's a <laughs> walnut. Yeah, it's all. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, this is badass. I'm not okay. That does what, work. What did you? I am. Sa- I, no, no, no. Oh. no, 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 no. This little product that. I got. This little product I got here is that we got insane. from Amazon. Yes. What product is it? Yeah. It's a little like, camera. It's like, it's like, it's like, camera or a light? It's a camera or a light? It's a camera. You really want to talk about it, but you also want no. To I'm not. Why. I'm not saying shit. What the hell is that? What is that thing? It's a, it's a little carrying case that comes with it. Everything comes with a little carrying case. 180? No, no, you had a logo. Let me see that. Wait, 180. Let's see the logo. 180. Let me see the... Oh, oh, there's nothing. Oh, you fucker. Oh, there. You fucker. Yeah, you oh, it's got a picture of a finger on it. It's an electronic <laughs> of some sort. It, I mean, uh, electrics. Look up finger <laughs> right. Yeah, look up electric case. <laughs> finger electronics. Zipper. No, it's oh, uh, you know what I've decided though. You said, or not you said. I'm sorry. I'm. I look I at it. you streaming, and I go, <laughs> me. Yeah, and I go like, I think I need to get some. Like I used to fucking edit, and then I would spend like one day a week maybe streaming, mm-hmm. and uh, and I felt like it kind of like brought me out of this like work cycle I'm in, and because I can't fucking seem to be productive at the same level I was. I'm thinking maybe I should just take like a little, like just a week where I just like stream a bunch. Yeah, yeah just to like great. snap myself Mark out of it. Wife. You could do yeah. Some. Like I don't I see. I should... oh, sorry, no, go, go ahead. No, no go ahead. My, my, my bad. No, I'm, go ahead. We're, no, we I... interrupt the guests enough. It's yeah. <laughs> it's time for the uh, guests. Uh, Julia, what for are a you? Change. <sighs> so I find it almost heroic <laughs> that you were able to. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go, guys. <laughs> <laughs> No, but I find uh, it it's heroic how you can stream for more than three hours because I stream pretty regularly and after like a two and a half, I'm dead. You're I'm dead. completely right. dead. Yeah. I know exactly what you're talking about. I yeah, it's like three now. hours. You know. After like, three I'm hours, done. it's done. Yeah, yeah, it's just hitting a brick wall. It's awful. Yeah, I don't it's know like a it marathon. Is. And, it's, and it's, those that push past me, and no one is. And it's like, yeah, I see stream clips where people are like, I miss this poop. And I was like jumping around doing skateboard Scream. tricks yeah, and stuff, yeah. screaming. I don't even have that much life in me anymore. I don't <laughs> even know how I was doing even that Even when on you stream. turn off stream, like, 
when I turn yeah, off stream, it's... I turn off for like 15 minutes and I just sit here and I go, uh, yeah. uh, when this podcast uh, is finished, I just turn off the lights and I just sit in the dark. I, I start <laughs> drooling until yeah. a piece of drool hits my fucking leg. And I, oh. I smoke a cigarette. I don't even <laughs> yeah. smoke. Uh, fuck. Yeah, it's, so, it's so like draining. It's, yeah. It really is. I just look at a picture of my, of my kids and I cry. <laughs> There's nothing wrong That's with that. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, no. Okay, dude. Unironically, I haven't cried in years. This what? shit is fucking brutal. I cried yesterday because. Wait, hold on. Does this have any? Okay, this doesn't have any pertinent information on it. I got this from the daycare. It's a beautiful. Oh. You're a dynamite dad from Olivia, and it's made with her little handprint. But oh. on the back is a poem that she I didn't read. Write that. No, she didn't write it. It was just she written by the one. by the fucking teacher. I mean, she's one. Of she course, didn't get, she didn't she didn't get suspended. She didn't read it. No, no. no. I was in there that like cool. uh, I was looking at this and I was like, oh, like there's a little poem on the back. It says, "Sometimes you will get discouraged because I'm so small and always leave fingerprints on furniture and walls, but every day I'm growing and I'll be grown up someday, and all these tiny handprints will simply fade away." Oh, that's that's so here's beautiful. a final that's handprint, that's so yeah, just so you can gross. recall. Exactly how my fingers looked when I was very small. Happy what Father's Day 2022. And I was just like, <laughs> That's, it's so pessimistic. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm like, Well, because it just hit me that I fucking don't have a baby for a kid anymore. Like she started walking and then she's lost. They instantly lose weight as soon as they start walking and yeah. they start looking like little people because they're like, <laughs> they actually yeah. do things. Yeah. Yeah. That process and so, is called Neotony. <laughs> <laughs> What? It is the elongation <laughs> of your face and everything, really? your body. Why, yeah, why her fucking grow? fat head is getting Damn. narrower, and she's getting like arms and legs and shit. And her like little baby feet are I just love, like perfectly I, round. But I love being able to bring bring up that. I, this is probably the fifth time I've said that on the podcast. I go, oh, Miatni, Miatni is what he's saying. Miatni, I think. Miatni. Yeah. In, Mutiny. In the, uh, okay. T- t- you said that. I'll tell my kid. I'll be like, don't multiple. It's. Well, who says you're muting it. and stop it? <laughs> it's, um, it's, well, I had this class, and the teacher one day as a throwaway was like, all right, you'll never need to know this term for an exam. And he's like, Nyatni, it means like when, you know, everything, like all, most animals, especially mammals, like when you're babies, you're all like cute and squishy and shit, and then you elongate and you blah, blah, blah. And it's he's like, that process is called this. But you don't need to know that. And then anytime I wouldn't know the answer to a question on a test, I'd be like, is it Neotni? And the guy's like, shut the fuck up. No, it's not. Like, no, it's not that. And now, like, maybe five times since that class, I've had the chance to be like, I know what that is. And it feels really good every time. And it's my, like the only thing I remember from that class. My grandfather <laughs> drilled into my head a uh, mnemonic. Oh, so fucked up. Oh. Yeah, he but, like, <laughs> yeah. My grandfather was Jeffrey Dahmer, and he was like, you are going to be my fuck toy, and he drilled into my head, and yeah, I was fucked up. Like, but no, he used fucking... to... <laughs> he <laughs> bolts on the, in my temple. <laughs> the, uh, he, he taught me this word mnemonic, which is an aid to memory, and he would make me spell it. It's like it M-N... Yeah, mnemonic. He would mnemonics. he would say shit weird, which yeah. was funny to me. You say shit weird, but I do. Yeah, yeah. I probably get it you from say him. Like him. Yeah, it was hilarious. Say- he went to he went to uh, Germany after World War II to like during Reconstruction era or whatever, mm-hmm. and he uh, he came back over there it's and he's like he's there. like yeah uh, you want to hear some German uh, Sprechen Sie Deutsch? <laughs> I'm like is okay. a southern guy pronouncing mispronouncing like the worst in the world. like he's so heavy-handed with everything he says so like, i just got back from a, a vacation up in quebec <laughs> I'm like, Come on, dude. like you're not even trying but uh yeah he taught me mnemonic or mnemonic and only because he had a little uh you know the little walmart smiley face stickers remember those yeah it was like a little yellow smiley face. He had one of those next they, to his they speedometer. They killed that fucking mascot. What happened? Did, to did that? they? I don't know. He's just gone. Dude. Smiley yeah, they face. Him. Yeah. Yeah. You ever seen Watch? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they shoot him in the face. They throw him off the building. Yeah, they throw him off the building. The very <laughs> beginning, shit. never seen again. That yeah. is especially around the same time that that logo died. Then, yeah. <laughs> yeah, what yeah, the it was fuck? like 2005, 2006 they or whatever when that movie had came some out. Weird contracting thing where they <laughs> got to kill off the Walmart yeah. mascot. 
And now their Whoa. new mascot is uh, some fat white inbred yeah. American you know, in a in a rascal <laughs> scooter. A they little have, rascal. Like, no, they have uh, no like mascot. Logo. Yeah, like what's even their logo? Just the word Walmart. It's just it's it like fucking a fucking Walmart. Kind of? Yeah, it's got like little a little sun, like little fucking rectangles going different They're directions. like sun rays, I think. Yeah. Sun rays? What the hell? On the, around yeah, the W like, or something. It's like a kid uh, drawing a sun like and then they shit. remove the center circle. Yeah, it's horrible. Oh, no, it's what the, the hell? Sorry. It looks like it, fucking shit. Bring back the have, smiley face. They used to have like oh, the textbook smiley <laughs> face that looks like you'd get it on a bouncy ball. Yeah. Like it's like. Yeah, yeah. It is so generic. Did they. But it was Because awesome. I remember they, looking oh, for that little face because that's where the deals were. Yeah, yeah, exactly. They should just change it to like where your only option. Like this is it. They don't need a fucking logo. They don't need a name yeah, on the true. store. I mean, it's yeah, just true. True come get one. your shit here. This is the only grocery store and only any like general store in the area. For most people that go to that, it's like it's usually like little small towns, and then there's like a Walmart strategically in the middle between yeah. all of them. And everybody's uh, like, "All right, I'm going. It's my only option. I'm going to Walmart." You see that Mr. Peanut got killed? I was thinking about the smiley face. Like yeah, they, when they, they like, like fell down the cliff. You're talking yeah, about like in yeah. vilified peanut for a second. I'm like, what? <laughs> no, 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 I wouldn't have said that. Like that. <laughs> oh, like peanut died. Yeah, he fell and his head exploded. No, it was uh, it, it's like. <laughs> Fucking Mr. Peanut sacrifices himself to save like the rest of the people because they're hanging on a yeah. Bed yeah. or on a branch. And, like, then like back, a and then there's like baby nut and then baby they, peanut. everyone yeah. hated him and they're really <laughs> just going like they're. they're uh, right. I mean, it's hard to stay relevant as a peanut company in a world that's kind of that's like fucking gourds basically. Yeah. Like peanuts are for old people. Uh, kids, excuse uh, me, peanut even. butters love that. Uh, like kids peanut love butter, that. now that's yeah. different, but they are specifically yeah. in the peanut space. They don't they even... Tra- yeah, like they they wait, Planters doesn't ingredient. make peanut butter? I guess I they don't own Jif that's or some so shit? Dumb. That's see. so dumb. I mean, maybe it's, Big Peanut is all They never thought of thing. mushing them things up? Yeah. <laughs> we like no, it they as they got They got planters. They got it. Yeah, but it's not Jif, is it? No, no, it's their they, own thing. It's their own brand. They don't, even have, they don't even have the. Um, they don't even have Peter Pan. They don't have if Jeff, you're they, in the audience and you own a Planters peanut, peanut butter, butter jar, get the fuck out of here. Or, <laughs> yeah. I don't know how it I've is. I've never I've seen that. Jif or live, yeah. Yeah, like, it, Jif or I guess. Yes, good. Uh, or yeah. like Peter butter. Pan. I don't know if Peter he has. Pan. I think Jif. Jif is such a staple. It's just hard to beat. You know. It is. He has like the championship belt. It's kind of like thing. Heinz. Yeah. I love yeah, Jif so yeah, much. Yeah, yeah. Abby came home and was like, "There's a huge recall because all this like E. coli or something in the the Jif peanut butter." And I said, "I'm Who gonna cares? chance it." And I had a fucking <laughs> I had a peanut butter sandwich right then and there. She told Jeez. me as I was making one. She's like, "We need to throw that away." I was like, "No, nah, I'm gonna like, chance it." Basically, made pick it. up a spoon just yeah. Yeah. force eating it. Yeah. yeah, I licked the peanut butter <laughs> off the spoon. <laughs> But if you died no. from that, she would be we'll so see. Yeah. We'll see. That would be awesome. <laughs> she would she be just so get, like, violently <laughs> ill. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's a good way to die <laughs> by you. Jeff, you know? I'm so hungry from all this diarrhea. Can you make me a peanut butter <laughs> yeah. sandwich? Yeah. Yeah. More peanut butter. <laughs> It'll clog it up. Yeah. I can't hold anything down for some reason. <laughs> uh, uh, peanuts would clog you up if you just... If you eat a bunch of peanuts, do you shit out peanut butter? Right? <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess so. I think that's I how that works. works. Huh? Kind of. Works. Do you I'm guys buy the? Do, yeah. do sure. you fuck with the regular peanut butter? or Do you get the natural with like the oil in it? You know what I'm talking about? Uh, uh, I don't actually, like how it all sits at the top like that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah but once you mix it, it, dude, if you yeah. fucking you know, spoon that thing, I don't like it that wet. It's just yeah, it's supposed to be like. It's supposed Dude, to be solid, you, you know, like cement. If you whip it with a spoon, because the, the, the stuff at the bottom's so dry, it makes a, it's way better than regular peanut butter. I mean, that's the shit my mom always gets, so like, I've, yeah, I've had it my whole life. I Wait, like crunchy. So, yeah, is it crunchy, crunchy or Jeff. smooth for you guys? I don't give a I'll shit. Eat either, I don't give a shit. I'll, I'll peanut butter crunchy, peanut butter it's to like, me, how did planters not think of this? Hey, it's yo, peanut butter poop. with peanuts in it. What? Stick out your finger, your ring finger towards the camera. Your other ring finger. I got your, married. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I think I might be able to like. Oh. Propose to them. I can put it on the fucking, on the lens. 
Wait, hold out, hold out your index finger up to the camera. I can snatch your ring off. <laughs> no, no, I don't want to give me that. <laughs> yeah, yeah like, can oh, I see that ring up close? <laughs> can you see that thing? Uh, we should get some real else. badass fucking like the what are the rings that go across all your knuckles or oh, whatever we, they're like I cuffs know. I know you're talking about yeah, yeah we should get custom. I do want some multi-finger rings yeah we should get some badass ones that say like embossed on them like forehead a forehead fables Four. that way if you fucking punch someone oh. it leaves it and they're like hey can still... I get a signature and you go bah, and you crack them right in the head still leave think it somehow a ring imprinted that when you put four of them together makes a d20 would be pretty sweet but i That's just don't weird. have the technology for that right now but like take them off like one of those celtic knots and like they're intertwined maybe or like with somehow when we all do this we oh, each have like forms. a d4 that you know or i guess 25 yeah you know, i don't know how that works i don't know what it fucking i'm thinking i'm trying to i'm there. making it the shape is too complex. There's it no is way. Too complex. <laughs> no, it would have to be a D20 cut into four pieces. Or somehow a ring. It wouldn't even make sense. If there's someone like with out. a brain, can you cut yeah. this into four pieces and it work <laughs> as a ring? Just we need goddamn... We need someone... If, if there's someone that majored in jewelry technology yeah. but minored in geometry or something... Yes. That's be. a real strange mix-up. If you could, you this cut this your, into four what you've different. Been waiting for yeah, this is your yeah. life calling. Your life yeah. And I want the rings to be weighted so that they always land on this one right here. This twenty, and you, this needs yeah. to be up cool every time. Too, if it had like just a regular D twenty ring, then you could spin it. And then mm. it's like, there's my pretty, roll, bitch. Pretty sure that's an actual thing. That's a real oh. thing, dude. Yeah. Instead of instead of a fucking dice cam, we should get a roulette wheel. That you then, oh, dude, I'd, yeah. I'd, I'd, yeah. I'd yeah, that. Dude, that would be, that would be awesome. yeah. one of those bingo things where you fucking. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, it comes out. It yeah. adds like five hours to the entire yeah. thing. Just filming. Yeah. Hold on, guys. I'm, <laughs> I'm writing that down. Um, that's I getting right now. You're writing which one? The wheel or the bingo? The wheel, the 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 wheel is a good The wheel one idea. is a great uh, idea. Uh, yeah. That's yeah. G. I'm going to get a wheel. Yeah. No, because I've looked up roulette wheels. Apparently, cost like twenty thousand dollars. They're super expensive. Well, There's like a an lot of casino one. Yeah, the the high end ones. They got like all sorts of ball bearings. I think it's just a lazy Susan with felt on it, right? And some uh, like a little spire yeah. in the middle. I had a I little see why casino toy, up, and you know? it was like there was a plastic roulette that you can get that was just this big, and it's like. Nothing costs nothing. You can use that one. It's no, there's no point the unless show. it's super heavy and it's the size and of Abby's, the one of Wheel Abby's of Fortune. Be in a fucking, <laughs> he's gotta be in a suit with a little fucking bow yeah. tie and she's gonna be there like, has to be, it. it has <laughs> to come with a person. Like it needs yeah. to. I want the Wheel of Fortune one is like 10 feet across. That's what I want. Oh, that fucking big one. Wheel. Yeah, oh my God. even bigger. Four times the size. Or the wheel Hope that they have like for Price down. is Right. The giant fucking yeah. thing. Oh yeah, that's a more <laughs> vertical one. The Wheel of Fortune yeah. wheel is like on the ground, right? Yeah, it's on yeah. the ground. Yeah. Uh, that show's been on for so long. Has anybody ever fallen in it after it gets spinny? Because ah! <laughs> <laughs> it has to be stop heavy. It, stop it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm surely someone fucking died. Fucking throws up all over the goddamn yeah. wheel. God I remember damn, I was dude. I was watching that with my mom, <laughs> and someone did. Yeah, I know. Someone did like a half-ass spin. <laughs> When I was watching it with my mom one time, and the guy goes like, "He's like, all right, come on, give it, give it a real spin." Like he got like angry with him. <laughs> he's like, "No, with, you need don't to, fuck with it. Don't you, fu you fucking give that <laughs> thing a real thing, spin." Yeah. This wheel's older than you. Okay, show some goddamn respect. <laughs> this wheel will be here when you're in a fuck when you're in a jar on the mantelpiece. You spin this thing with some fucking respect. <laughs> And they did. They fucking straightened up. Hold a salute after pose after you do it. Spun. It's so hard. It flew up in the air. <laughs> I was. We were playing. What's a fucking dog shit? You you guys make me play sometimes on Discord when everybody's in a group. It's like not Gardic phone. It's like uh, Jackbox. Jackbox. I talked about the wheel of power. power. Oh, there was some the bullshit with the wheel, wheel of power. power. Yeah, and it was just like just you would see shit. some people would just like like bear they they barely spun it because it was fungal. Fungal tone knew yeah. how he would just give it a little bit of because uh, he he knew he how to line it up with. With this week. fucking thing, a yeah. Week. Some yeah. people were asking where where the hell's fungal? Where's better. fungal been? That's where he's been. <laughs> yeah, that's he's the been he's figuring out how to win that shit. Yeah, and he's been training. playing GTA RP. Those are the two things he's still uh, doing. Yeah, GTA RP. Oh, yeah, he's he, built a whole nother life that's way more successful than his real life in GTA RP. <laughs> he made well. He's been playing Football Manager. That shit's been fun. It's just he has like a team with all of our names, and it's just like you get invested, dude. It's like your little man, dude. 
a piece of you is in the game. You know, he made like, a, when you he fuck made a up, team. Every player is someone in the Discord in, in call. Our, in our, yeah, like in our in, in the chill guys chat and shit. Like it's dude, you you feel emotionally connected to your Who's little the guy, best dude. Player? Uh, I don't know. We they're all he put us in like some shit league, hey, so we're all like really bad. But it's funny. I don't know who would be the best. It's like, player. It's like him, saddle of him. <laughs> Can yeah, you give them smart. traits like yeah. prone to fight? Can you get, have like a Vinny Jones type prone player? To like yeah. You, I think yeah, you that's can. like you can, you headbutts can, people. Like, <laughs> you can rig it so that they have it's different. The most like, aggressive I think... soccer player we've ever seen. Honestly, <laughs> yeah. I can't say anymore. I can't even like look a at baller. <laughs> no, our our whole team for some reason is nervous around big games. So like we'll just <laughs> shit we'll shit on everybody, and then as soon as it's a tournament, we just start fucking getting blasted. Big, big game? Oh, like okay. Yeah, like I thought big, you meant like games. you guys travel to like local high schools and mop the floor with <laughs> non professionals. No, no, no. No. Uh, we just show up at the local fields, mop yeah, up, we just go beat home. We pub stomp kids. And <laughs> yeah, we pub stomp so hard, cool. but if it's an actual booked a booked yeah. team, we fucking flounder. Yeah, we just throw uh, it. If the opposing team has any sort of coordination or team team anything team play of it, any, if they pass the ball to each other they win really <laughs> oh shit yeah. it's just a big brawl it's just though. 10 strikers on the team this is in a rec league against a bunch of little boys <laughs> i saw uh, a map it was like international distribution of like team sports like where in the world sports are played and the whole world plays British soccer yeah, hey, and then there's like Five people One that watch like baseball. Yeah. yeah. Ho like hockey, you need to keep that shit alive because there's like four people that still enjoy that shit. Uh. And then uh, and then Poob is just like falling asleep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> looks like everyone in the world plays top. golf. Every fuck, country. Except top well, fuck golf. golf. Sport, dude. Uh, top golf rocks. It's got a I point mean, system. I mean, it's perfect. It's fights like bowling for golf. It's, oh, yeah. <laughs> you know what I think would be fun? Just what? going out with your boys playing curling. Curling? Yeah, where really do you go for that? Curling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where do you yeah. Like yeah. Like curling like out out to 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 that would be way more fun just, and more team building than bowling, <laughs> I think. We just all three it set was. a sentence. A That's like bowling. At the same time. <laughs> <laughs> but each role is like, Dude, you have cuts. three people doing it, you know? Like, it's it seems like such a bro sport. Yeah. We but should then it's like a who gets to be the guy that shoots it down, who gets to be the guy that sweeps. I want I want a scrubby. I want a little scrubby brush. I feel I like I'm scrubby it. brush uh, material. I don't have the steady hand to, to to guide the rock. Yeah, I think I could pass the rock pretty hard, but in reality, I'd probably end up scrubbing. <laughs> I'm a scrubber, right? God, it, doesn't that suck when you're just two scrubbers looking for a rock guy? You know, yeah, that's a that's horrible. a a curling story that's um, older than time itself. I can't get over how small <laughs> that fucking ceiling fan is. That <laughs> thing so <laughs> tiny up there. So my grandpa uh, used to tell me, so there's scrubbers and there's rock throwers. You're yeah. a scrubber. Don't ever try to not be. <laughs> Stay in your fucking scary. class. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Know your lane. He, I, <laughs> my grandpa did tell me. I've taught, I've said this before, but he was like. Yeah, us blank on my last name, boys. Like, we don't have hops, okay? Like, you probably are not going to play basketball <laughs> or football or anything. He's like, just stay. You like, you know what you're good at. Like, try tennis, try golf. Maybe, you know, soccer. I played soccer. I was I think your grandpa's a fucking idiot because you got long legs. You could, I bet you if you trained, you could get like 40 inch vertical leap. I can jump maybe two inches off the ground. <laughs> That's I, a storm. I, I, That's I a can storm. jump so I, I was playing beers <laughs> the other day and I think I had my highest jump of all time and and all my friends were like, Whoa and I probably jumped like this high <laughs> yeah. to like fucking catch a frisbee. Great. I felt like You're... I fucking touched the atmosphere, like upper atmosphere. I, I I felt like I was in the air. Like my fall down was twenty seconds. Oh, a huge oh, yeah. Jesus. Yeah. You ever jumped up high and then on the way down you go like my legs are just gonna Whoa. crinkle under me? Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah. oh I actually jumped ten feet in the air. <laughs> Time. Yeah. I'm gonna shatter Oops, on impact. Never have that. Yeah. Ever yeah. Just yeah. Jump like way too high. <laughs> yeah. That would be so, so awful if you could jump that high, but you didn't have super strength. So every uh, time you jumped, you just break your legs. All right. I'm gonna, I think we should call it here. That's, that's yeah. I that's think, so I think it's all too. I think it's all too. Uh, stall cut that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's find out.